else other than the shared spiral? Any other ideas for what I should put on? Hello and welcome back uh, to just that for the friend skull. Elden Ring, Shadow of the Air Tree. As you can see, I'm here with Jasper and Slade, and we're... some Gelmira's Fury. We've got ourselves an extra day thanks to our schedules finally lining up. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to remember where we left off last time. I imagine for the people watching the VOD, this I stuff will be easy, don't. but. No. Well, I guess that's the thing with an open world game like this. Theoretically, progress can be any, virtually any direction, just depends how much you want to suffer. Pretty much. But yes, uh, if you use the Maddening Hand in your offhand slot, and use Hal of Shabiri to go full madness, it will give you a 20% damage buff. Mm, I am. Interesting. And then you can combine it with that uh, one talisman we just got. Hmm. But I'm gonna fire up my string. Mine's already started. Though of course you would need the amount of uh, fate to get a uh, Alashaberry going on. But. Hmm. Smash to this old imp to be fashioned. Dragons, a big mouth that serves as a cannon, allows to fire shells in the rear of the battlefield. It sounds like another decent ranged option, but the fact it's not a named enemy makes me question a few things. Death Knight. The K Golden Wheel that adorns its head as unbroken loyalty to Godwin, who became Prince of Death. Oh yeah, we did see more of Godwin's eyes in the area we fought Death Knight, didn't we? Mm-hmm. Boy, for a dead guy, he really knows how to get around. Well, that's just it. He's not dead. He's the very first who is living in death. Yeah, no soul, but still but still body. And that looks like you only need 33 faith for Hal Shabiri. I guess I can think about that once I finish my dex, get my dex to 40. Hmm. And uh, let's go to the bridge leading to the village waypoint. In a minute, I'm thinking of grabbing another uh, spirit ash up. Let's try up Mira. Uh, which one again? Bridge the turnabout? Bridge leading to the village. I think that's Apparently I can't actually talk to anybody here right now. Also, I hope you have the beast repellent torch on you, because, uh, oh yeah, there's gonna be a lot of wolves on the way. Huh, that's a very descriptive name, Bridge Leading to the Village. Hmm. Apparently I am not allowed to actually work on any Spirit Ashes right now. She is busy thinking that she is at the very beginning of the entire pain of Telling her to do spirit tuning. So that's cool. Uh, that's uh, that seems a bit awkward. Just a little. Uh, what section is that that you guys are at? Bridge leading to the village. Yeah, in the Shadowlands. Well, the Shadow Rim. Yes. <laughs> ah, there we are. Okay. Down by the cathedral.
Oh, it only attacked Torrent, not me. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Raging beast. Oh boy, a raging beast. Sprinkle, sprinkle. Sprinkle, sprinkle. What are you doing? Laughing at the wolves as I put uh, ice ashes out. Put the, the ice perfume out. It's one-shotting them pretty nicely. No, well, except for the white ones, but, you know. They like to be a little joined with a lot anyway. How do you feel without a pack? Huh? Huh? Come on, when even the mage can take your ass on solo, you're doing it wrong, Wolf. Ah. Pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. So, what are we doing in this shithole? We're going to make our way up to uh, the big old temple thingy. Hmm. And try not to get killed by the, uh, the golem. I mean, I'll try, but I promise nothing. Shouldn't we just kill the thing oh, wait, anyway? Actually, this is one that we can just throw pots into the top of. Oh, well, even better then. Just need to remember how to get up there. Yeah. Like most things, it probably takes a little bit of shackle. Don't see me on this side. Might have to hit it from the other side. Probably. Oh, yep, yeah, there's the spirit spring. Found it. Yep, it's right under its feet. Oh, no. Oh. It's not horrible. How do you two hand a weapon again? On uh, keyboard? Yeah. Uh, the way I have it is I hold down E and hit left uh, mouse button. Okay, thanks. Mm hmm. Good job. Sorry, I guess I'm still adjusting since I'm so used to a controller. Mm. Ba -doop. Sprinkle, sprinkle. I know, I only have fire, I have frenzied fire. <laughs> Does it actually give you frenzy as you use it? No, I don't get the status, if that's what you mean. Hmm. Good. Pro it probably inflicts it on enemies, but it only affects tarnished, or rather humanoid enemies. Hmm. Uh, my understanding is that it affects anything with a hum with a player model, basically. Yeah. Well, that's why I wasn't sure whether or not it would actually uh, uh, inflict the status on you as you're using it or not. Uh, we're still playing the game of let's not hit a single grace. Yep. Because uh, we got this place up here. Mm. Now watch as we all die horribly and then get sent back to the ass end of nowhere. What? When would that ever happen? We're so good at the game. Rabbit's cannon. In case uh, you didn't like your old cannon, here's a new one. Now you can dual them. Or I can hand you mine, and you can dual wield that one. Is there anything else in the tower worth being up there for? Uh, no. Okay. Sadly, it does not appear that way. Mm. Oh, hey, this one does magic damage. Neat. So where are we Let's going now? Drink. Uh, to this elevator. Uh... Okay. 
that, that's why I asked about the inside of the tower, but you said there was nothing there, so I was kind of oh, confused as to why we're oh, he still he inside the, the tower. <laughs> Horrible, horrible flies. Time to show them the power of madness. Or I would, but they aren't player models, so they aren't tarnished. Hmm. It is kind of annoying, especially when you notice all the things that get inflicted with madness in the game. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah, even things already insane can get madness, apparently. Mm hmm And here I was thinking madness and madness would make them sane. Very sane. Mmm, no. The negative and the negative do not a positive make. Damn it. I hate these things. Aren't you happy to see these guys? No. Never. I had the angry emote a minute ago when it knocked me off the horse. Nice. I need to get some more emotes for this. A bit tricky though, the artist is perpetually swamped. Mm. Understandable. Good artists tend to be. Madness still count as fire. Yes. Because it's still the frenzied flame. So it should still count as fire. Okay, good. Because I'm pretty sure those guys are weak to fire since you know they're made of wood. Hmm. I have a ton of arrows sticking out of me. Yeah, you really did. I'm a pincushion now. <laughs> Uh, so well, do you face your previous character? Very fast, is he? What? No, no, Torrent is not very fast at all. And now this guy will give us a whole lot of lore. Hmm. Maybe I'll actually get to hear some of it this time. The other group was particularly patient about that kind of thing. Hold on, let me sit down. Oh, yeah, I'll do that too. <sighs> Still a little ways to go for a level. <laughs> He's going to hide us, isn't he? No, why would he do that when he's going to give us the lore? Because we just opened a door with a grace right in front of it. Well, it's a new building. Of course it has a thing in front of it. We don't often receive visitors. I am Ymir. Welcome to Manus Meta. I thought that was pronounced Ymir. Pleasure to have you. In land so forsaken... Oh, the Moogle has arrived for the lore as well. Indeed. Hmm. Seeing that we have convened here on this day, Allow me to mark the occasion. Yay! A map and a really creepy dildo. Is something I've given you a map to the oh, I suppose you expect a lesson of me, do you? I know the feeling. Those with purpose are nothing if not ravenous for power. Truth. I too am a glintstone sorcerer. We study the stars and examine the life therein. Let's see, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. Long ago. And he has his own version of a invisibility spell. Cool. 
Our children. Don't step on any children. Is that not divine? Yep. That Make sure you watch out for the little boy. And yet, none can fathom its implications. It's They're the not so little girl over here. And now we have to get up to that thing or ruin. Alright, now, what did you say to be careful of? That's how I was listening to his lecture. It's really more of a joke. I think we have to go to the Cerulean Coast. For the, uh... Getting into the ruin there? Yeah, finger ruin down there. Hmm. I believe so? Teleport to the coast. Cerulean coast. So not the city, just the coast. Cerulean coast. Coastest with the mostest. I mean, I was making a joke, but I guess he didn't get it. Yeah, it's okay. He probably didn't play enough Pokemon. weird because he was a Vaporeon long before he would squirrel huh I don't actually remember having a Vaporeon before I'm at the Cerulean Coast see anyone Cerulean Coast or Cerulean Coast Cross oh there's the difference whoops there you go I am not very smart. <clears throat> well, and you're lucky you're pretty. Also, beware the dragon. I have absolutely no idea how to take that. Why should we beware it? Shouldn't we just murder it? Oh, uh, we can try. I'm not much of the beware type. I'm more of the put a laser through it type. Though, of course, since this one's without a whole lot of flesh, it does tend to bounce around like a jackrabbit. Along with still being a dragon, making it a complete ready fucking coward. Shall we summon then? Go for it. Alright, I was trying this one out. Let's see how it goes. Let's see if it dies instantly or not. I love when you stop and roar. Please do that more. Aw. Oh, ran out. Sadly, I don't think this thing can be poisoned. Still get it it knocked on its ass tomorrow. there. <laughs> that too. Or blitz. Frenzy, eat frenzy flame, bitch. Also have some moons. Oh, uh, okay. You can apparently knock me out of that somehow. Flame. If you're gonna do that, you should be over here in this pool. Give me old lightning business there. Yeah, he ran out of the pool. He also ran out of life. Shame. Okay, those lightning spears are very crazy. Oh yes. They're ever so good. Frenzy Flame seems to basically Oops. be the same as the regular fire, if we're honest. Just with yeah, it is. It just does flint frenzy on... Oh. Hmm? Oh? Alex's summon is very angry over there. Uh... Honestly, it's actually yeah, doing pretty well. Hmm. 
Yeah, I did real well in that boss fight. That's not bad. Okay, so notice how the Tengu looking enemies are still pretty good. <laughs> I guess it just hates those guys in shadow. Uh, it will attack anything, basically. Pretty much. Uh, usually a summon only attacks things that I attack. Uh, if it has red eyes, it'll attack anything. And that one has red eyes. That explains why they're emphasized on the uh, summon icon. Yep. It's the scripture will also tell you that it'll attack anything. Hmm. Gotta watch out for those things that are uh, that red natured. Very beast like. Still, you can never have too many berserkers lying around. <laughs> uh, if they're lying around, they're not doing much good. They should be screaming around. Here I leave behind my sense of what the hell am I doing? There it is. There's the coast. At least I think this is it. Alex, stop getting murdered. I'm not taking any damage. Now Alex Slade, getting that's hit. getting murdered. I'm not even at half health. I'm not getting murdered. I'm just getting lightning debt. You've got a lightning debt. Apparently. Now for some of our favorite enemies. No. They're no one's favorite enemies. Oh. Uh, they're not even attacking that one yet. Are we just running by them then? Oh no, I'm gonna well, frenzy we play. I mean, not they're usually high chance. Hmm. They are just the wretched monstrosities. So you had mentioned how these look like ships? Yeah, they're They are coffins. in fact both ships and coffins. Yep. Yeah, I read that. They are indeed. Oh, a great gl gross glove war. Don't mind if I do. Hmm. Did we ever learn what these shade things are? Uh, they're people with a crab on their head. That's it? Honestly, kind of disappointing. I don't think anything ever really gives any uh, specific lore on them. All right, eter eternal sleep pot. For when you really want to make sure that that godskin duo is having a very nice nappy time. It will put them to sleep for several minutes. Even through being attacked, usually. Sometimes. Yeah, I was going to say, does getting attacked still <laughs> break it? Eventually. It's just a lot harder. That is genuinely really nice. Mm -hmm. Sounds like sleep builds really got a nice buff. And eventually yep. you'll get an eternal sleep sword. Oh man, it's not only that it got a buff, it gets a fucking centerpiece. Right, because St. Trina and Mikkel are the same person. Hmm. Finally confirmed. Or speculated. if not the same person, then they were definitely, like, of the same body at one point. Not impossible, given what we know with Radigan and America. Hmm. And given Mesmer and everything, we know that uh, once America 
shed off her other form and it turned into Radigan. She immediately said wood. <laughs> so, uh, wait, to herself or to Mesmer? Because, <laughs> what? Uh... I mean, apparently all. Mesmer is their very first child. Yep. Careful, there's fingers in the sand. They do love to dig in. Okay, I think we have to go off the side up here. There certainly doesn't seem to be an aquatic theme overall. Even Godwin looks more mermaid-like when we find the body with Fia. Hmm. This reminds me of that one place in Thailand, uh, um, the White Temple. Have you ever seen that? Nope. White Temple in Thailand. It basically just has a bunch of hands uh, in surrounding a temple. That looks actually like a horror movie location. Uh, yeah, it's it's about to get pretty horror. Uh, this one is slightly less horror than the other one. Mm, true enough, but you know, it still uh, it still gets there. Also, watch out for the spider people. I mean, the snake people. Looks like there's fingerprints on these, like the three fingers. Yeah, they definitely all have marks on them. Uh, you know what? Let's go down here first. Also, because the quest is actually down here. If I remember correctly, I think those things are maybe not quite snake, but actually the fingers. And some of them cast, so you want to watch out for that. And their casting is uh, annoying. Oh yeah. Their casting is super fucking annoying. And the other guys will try to paralyze you so that they can have the caster come over and eat you. Literally, or? Literally. Welcome to your first four enemy. I mean, well, we have well, several in the we'll expansion. See. Yeah, <laughs> of the DLC. I was gonna say, the main <laughs> game has a ton of enemies that eat you. What are you talking about? Yep. It's almost like people find it horrifying or something. Yeah. Nail stone. I suppose we had so many fingers, nails would be inevitable. <laughs> no thank you and your wiggly spell bullshit. It hates Jasper, apparently. Fuck you. Apparently, it should learn how to hate magic. <laughs> okay, keep going back and forth. Which way are we going? I don't know. Uh, I'm I think to go get the drop. Ah. Well, is that Alex? I said, I don't know. I'm following Jasper. Hmm. Yeah. He seems to have pretend he has some idea what he's doing. <laughs> I mean, sometimes he does. Sometimes he has the general idea and hasn't really worked out any details. Uh, so Alex, what do you think is going to be in the center over there? A, a thumb. We've seen so many fingers, but not a single thumb. Well, yeah. I mean, a thumb is something you expect on the frenzied flame. Oh, ow. Yep, that's the spell. Oh, well, luckily it doesn't kill Also, we're being towards. attacked by other ones. Yep. None of you are, the, are a match for the Frenzied Flame.
All right, and here we are. I swear, I'm basically unlimited Blaine work semi at this point. A beehive? It's a horn. A finger horn. Crimson seed talisman plus one. That honestly seems kind of underwhelming. Uh, it makes your healing flasks do more healing. I guess with my HP, that is good. Oh, yeah. With your HP, it might make it so you only have to use one of them instead of like two or three. Uh, let's go back up to uh, Finger Ruins of Rhea. Oh? Not back to Manus Metter? Uh, not yet. There's that one Patu up there I wanted to check out. Alrighty. Very well. Crack, crack back. <clears throat> what was that? Uh, that was the last gasp of supper. It's all rainy and dark. Ugh. I was gonna Start say it time. sounded like a deer in headlights. Well, at least it wasn't a toad croak this time. Take what small victories I can get. I already have almost 300k runes. Our enemies here are really generous. It is the DLC, and these guys are pretty jacked up in their level and stuff. Oh, yeah. Makes sense, yeah. And apparently, there is just nothing up here. Hmm. Exciting. Oh, no, there's one of these guys you can use to duplicate a uh, thing. Ah, uh, yeah. Just want to get a That's where it's at. Well, now we can go back to the cathedral. And get more hot juicy lore. Oh yeah. That lore. And then get directions to the next run, which requires going through one of the most annoying bosses in the game. That sounds like every boss in the game. No, 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 no. He means one of. Yeah, that sounds like all of them. All of them are one of the most annoying. Well, see, here's the thing about it. It has a charge attack, which those are usually pretty bad. Uh, but this thing has a charge attack that basically just doubles its uh, its hitbox in every direction. <laughs> there you are. The exalted timbre of the bell has reached these ears of mine. Gracious, the starry sky is wondrous tonight indeed. Only your fate shines brighter. Now, these are for you. Think Beloved Stardust. It, I have made my decision to be of help. May the gleaming stars guide you evermore. Ah, you met Yulan. Well, I hope that she behaved, at least. The poor girl has overcome grave misfortune. Her tongue can be sharp at the best of times. But don't think that makes her a bad person. <laughs> it's no surprise her little sister, too, has a heart of gold. Ever young Mikola saw things for what they were. He knew that his bloodline was tainted, his roots mired in madness. A tragedy, if ever there was one. That he would feel compelled to renounce everything. And the blame lay square. And now you can learn some of the finger sorceries. Also, he has a child now. Yep. Brooklyn Stone Sorcery. One of the finger sorceries that they discovered in the hollow ruin blings a magic nail that crumbles. Oh yeah, glenstone nails. 
Bulls anyway, uh, play it. Count you no, near, right, we need to talk Bulls to her again, I think. Near, near child's play, echo. Hey, the gleaming stuff. Don't get the wrong idea. We are neither friends nor confidants. I am merely honoring Count Emir's wishes. And once her grumpiness is done being talked to, Church District High Road. We're going to go to the other entrance of the Shadow Keep. Woo! Of course, there's always a back door. So oh, I'm this getting... one is extra fun. So what I'm getting from this is basically the Orbone Monastery. Also, did you enjoy the lore? Uh, the instructions that America were receiving were uh, faulty? You better love it when your fingers are attuned wrong. How are the Glenstone Nail well, spells, anyway? Um, it's what those guys are shooting at us. But yeah, basically that. So close range, but pretty good. Well, it's pretty good when the enemy use it. Yeah. It's alright for us. It's not a bad spell, it's nothing amazing. <clears throat> I'll have to uh, put it on my uh, bar when we actually stop at Grace at some point. Provided Jasper ever decides that he wants to stop running around inside a bush. I'm all the way up here now. <laughs> yes, after you're done playing around in a bush. <laughs> I thought someone had... It was in my chat, but it was just a bot. Unfortunate. Aw, oh, we don't want to stop and take out the bunch of undead. Are they well, probably this one because it's getting close to the, uh... There's a lot of undead. Right? Actual undead or those who live in death? Probably live in those death. who live in death. I think the only things we actually have that are actually undead is the revenants and the little annoying revenants. Now remember to not attack this guy. Yes, no hitting the poor foragers. Oh, they also do that annoying thing from uh, regular Altus. Oh, some of you are firing things. Suckers! <laughs> Such a waste of a good aphrodisiac. Where is Alex? Uh, he's right here. Yeah, right by Jasper. Oh, okay, my thing's doing that thing where I can't see him at all. Probably because I'm on torrent. No, no, it's not the like bouncy your life bar goes back and forth somewhere, it's the I can't see you at all. It basically thinks right now that you are somewhere way the fuck south of us. Best in bone charge. Those are useful for a pretty good recipe. Oh. Okay, that does explain why there's random fire coming around. <laughs> For a second, I was like, did Jasper just like offhand the fire? It's like, no, no that's where our invisible Alex is. <laughs> well, good to know, even if I'm not here, my frenzied flame will be. Yep. All right, let's get to that entrance. 
and you'll be remembered in maddening spirit forevers. Also, I hope you like water. Oh boy, it really is the Orbone Monastery from Final Fantasy Tactics, isn't it? Hmm. Don't really know that one well enough to say, but uh, probably. Though it might be a little bit more ore boned in this one. Uh, does the Final Fantasy Tactics one have uh, ulcerated tree spirits? I'm j if they had thought of it back then, they would have, because they like to make that a pa one a pain in the ass. At least that means I have something decent I can put over Night Maiden's Mist. Then again, maybe I shouldn't be worried about that. Since I'm with other people, I should probably be worried more about the Tribute Dungeon 14 did to Tactics. In that case, uh, there's a there's a boss that's extremely famous for causing wipes because it asks you for prime numbers, and I swear nobody knows what a prime number is. Yeah, also, probably not. Also, one is not a prime number. <laughs> That's probably the big stickler. One is not a prime number, even though it seems like it should be, since it's a number you can only get by multiplying itself by one. Oh no. Hmm? Yeah, I fell into the water. I take it we can't With swim. With all of its loot. Aw. I take it we can't swim if we fall in? Nope. Instant death. You're not going for the item on the circle? Oh, right. Over there. After all, that's where we get to see Wrigley go. <laughs> He was running around down below. Oh, that is so cool. What? As seeing the thing wiggle down there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, another great glove hort. Technically, it's crawling uh, around. More or less. Oh, shit. Ah. You have a very weird voice. Apparently. Yeah, I thought you chose a twink voice. <clears throat> no, not in this one. Because I was trying to make them all crystallian. Sure, just have to do the jumping puzzle again and get my runes back. No pressure. Glad I didn't waste a rune arc. Mm -hmm. I miss Stormblood already. <laughs> that being the expansion where you got swimming. Oh, that's 14. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That would have sucked to have lost.
all that fire. Here's real fire. <laughs> uh, their fire is way more annoying. Oh, hey, I can see you again now. Because he's not on torrent. Also, he died. That might have helped. Did you say it in the third person? No, but I meant that because you had died at one point. Oh, cool. Yeah, who doesn't love flat farming? Indeed, who doesn't love flat farming? Well, yeah, I let's guess that was actually pretty slippery. To get to a grace and get you guys past it. Though, I guess if you died up on that spot, you kind of have to get it from that way anyway, don't you? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the runes would have dropped on the base. Yeah. Well, fuck. First of all, this requires a very annoying. <laughs> oh, getting to the ruins won't be a problem. Ah, I was close. It's just over here on the roof. Oh, what the? F what? You're oh. getting the prayer room key, just, uh, yeah. Perfectly timed, huh? Unfortunately, yes. <laughs> I didn't even know that, that thing was going to use a key. I thought that was just a shortcut thing to open. Well, Sorry don't talk that. to the guy inside, at least. Yep, I just wandered away from the door. I made it this time. Do I go in the building or? Yes. Yep. There'll be uh, rafters there to go to. Yet again, why I should never be the one going first. You seem to be alive, which is a lot better than us. Hmm. I'll grant you that, but, you know, he wouldn't have died if I hadn't uh, poked the door. Which is just complete unfortunate shit timing. Ruin of an unsung hero. Sparkle, sparkle? Yeah, there's a red, a red flame guy in there. What, the one I murdered? I don't think we have the proper item to give to this guy. Well, he's back the other way anyway. We're moving away from him. Yeah, no. Like I said, I don't think we have the proper item to give him. Hmm. Uh... Since there are two items you can give him. If yep. One item gets a sword from him, and the other item gets him as a spirit dash. Uh, what Is he actually a good spirit dash? Section? I don't know. I don't use them. What section is that item in anyway? Oh, we have one of the two of them. Well, we have the darkness thing, but I don't think we have the grace thing yet. Yep. Yeah, we don't. We got the occultation. Uh, there's a grace around here somewhere, right? Is that up the elevator thing? Because I really don't feel like more platforming, but that thing's a freaking shadow tree right now, so it's kind of hard not to. Aww. 
Oh, there might be a grace over here somewhere. Uh, I think you have to go up the elevator to get it. It's like right at the top. Let's find out then. What? the slow grind westward. Oh, this isn't correct. Oh, come on. There should have been a grace there. I saw gold. Uh, no. We actually want to go back down. The grace is right here, though. Huh. I just want to sit at it. I don't want to do the puzzle platform again. Boop. But, yep, we need to go back down. After all, there's a shadow tree fragment. After what? Uh, he had said this way is incorrect. And uh, I, I had said because we have a shadow tree fragment we want to get. And, you know, also other stuff, but. Shadow there's three mini bosses down there still. Yeah, the yeah. shadow fragment's what matters. Yep. Shadow. Yes, the fragment of skittish. Very sparkly, well done. Right, he's alive again. We need to fix that. Don't worry, you got it. Do you need to jump on the hand to get that item, or...? Yes. Yup. Very, very carefully at that. Because, uh, this thing is very fucking easy to drop off of. Hey, yeah, that's why we're gonna go drain the water first. Hmm. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Could have said so, you know, before I actually jumped in there and did the thing anyway, but... Sure. Where do we go? Ah, so we're in the water temple. Kinda, but not nearly that annoying, thankfully. Well, honestly, I don't think the Ocarina of Time Water Temple was actually all that bad. It's just a matter- it was just annoying because you- the Iron Boots was an equipment item you had to swap in and off, in and off. The remakes later just made it another- or uh, made it another- put it in a weapon slot, basically, so you could quick swap at will. So after yeah. that, it's just a matter of going to whatever room you haven't been to yet. Uh, if I remember correctly, there's a jump up above, so uh, mind your footing. Yeah, that seems like a really tricky... That's a rather mean yeah. trick, but I... It is. Get down here. I guess you... that one doesn't know how to get down? Lol. It's not a bad little hidey spot for the bat. If I was actually... No, you don't have to come up here. I know. Well, too bad. I'm going to. I mean, there's not really anything to do during the cinematic anyway, so it doesn't really matter if we're up or down. Uh, draining away all of that wretched death. So now we can die from breaking our bones when we land on our, our shins. Well, just make the jumps, then you won't do that. Not bad as do 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 do. Not bad <laughs> cinematic. Yeah, it's kind of their version of that one.
and basically the only time in all of Elden Ring where they're like, go over there. I think we can teleport to the church district entrance. I mean, we can just drop down here and get an item, too. I'll do that. Then again, maybe this trick doesn't work on a seamless. No clue. Oh boy, somber five. Hey, if you find uh, a new because weapon, you if like. you just teleport over here, it kills all three tree, tree spirits. Huh. Interesting sheet. But I don't think it works uh, in seamless, like I said. Hmm. Well, whatever the case, we have a grace over here now. Definitely Ooh, using enough it. Enough for a blessing up. Really? Why don't Why don't I have one? Did you miss one somewhere? I have. Uh, because to. you got the one on the statue. Oh right. He did not. Right. All uh, right. Right. So basically, I got it because I had balls. <laughs> yeah, like I'm going to miss that jump again. You saw how badly I've been doing at platforming. Ah, oh, that was more aimed at Jasper. I mean, you looked like you were getting ready to try it anyway, and then we were like, oh yeah, the draining the water thing at him was like, oh. Still weak to fire, buddy. Yeah, they still are. Though it does suck that he's sitting in water for that, but yeah, still. Yeah, unfortunate, but it is what it is. Not much I can do about it. It is. Yeah. That's fine, though. He's still perfectly laserable. And he still will catch fire. Yep. <laughs> though hopefully you're using something stronger than that spell. I'm using Frenzy Flame. Yeah. Not catch flame. Good. <laughs> oh boy. Horns. What's that? Terrible. Basically, it uh, is a spell that gives you the briar armor effect. Doesn't s sounds better for enemies than players. Because enemies will be hitting pretty regularly, but a player ideally you don't. You're, not, you're gonna run out of HP long before the enemy does from retaliation, that's for sure. Hmm. Here's number two. It shouldn't die. Oh, that's cute. It thinks it's a dragon. Shredding its poise with fire. There's the nails. Hey, yup. Not overly impressive. Oh, <laughs> oh look, we got another one of them. <laughs> now we have both eyes. Apparently, two eyes have two NPCs. Yeah, very, very occult eyes. <laughs> I'm sure they're perfectly fine. Sure, definitely. Hup. Rumble, rumble, bumble. I keep forgetting, the enemies are allowed to actually have range on spells. Yeah, those guys are really fire resistant. I'm gonna have to let your ice handle them. What the? Yeah. I guess ah, it disappeared with him. Four eyes.
Aw, no heals today. Uh, we're gonna be going back up here in just a minute. Hmm. I wanted to look at the Fire Knight seal, but I guess if you're going that way already, I don't want to fall too far behind. Yeah. I seem to have a habit of that. I told you what happened in our big siege fight, right? My character's probably not going to be back until after it's already over. Hmm. So they put this giant hole here, but there's nothing to do with it. It's just for flavor. Which hole? Just way the up there. Yeah, the one at the uh, top of the stairs. It just leads to death. Gotcha. But all kinds of death leave here. Lead here. <laughs> no death like the frenzy flame. Death. Mm, that's a bit less death and a bit more. We're just taking everything apart. Well, the main thing is it's just going to destroy everything and not put anything on the ashes, unlike the others. Hmm. Even Fia's ending, or the uh, Dung Eater ending, still tries to be tries to build something, even if it's something horrifying. I mean, Fia's is okay. You well, just give that, those that live in death the right to vote. Yeah. Well, that is true, and the big whole and the whole reason this was an issue in the first place is they tried to remove death as a concept. Yep, it was their own fault, and then they decided to villainize someone over it. That was affected by their shit. Cause America. Is, does the, is there anything good about the dung eater ending? Uh, not really. He basically just wants to omen curse everybody forever's. I guess everyone's equal when they're all cursed by the terrible blight. Yeah, it's, that's basically his view. If everyone's the, if everyone's cursed, then no one is cursed. Also, you definitely want to sit on yeah, this one. I was going to say, I'm definitely sitting here because this looks... Mm. Yeah, it's exactly how it looks. Well, at least we got Alex for flying. Yep. But, Hold uh... On. Hold on, Just, I uh... Oh, yep. Uh, I need to put an immunity thing on my bar, right? No. You're mostly gonna want to just watch out for being slapped around and spiked. Also, uh, watch your stamina because it likes running to one side of the arena, then to the other, and back and forth again. Oh, so it's not a poison swamp. I thought that was, seriously thought it was another poison swamp. Oh no, no, this is from something different. And, uh, also since Jasper's probably I'm, not going to tell you, this has multiple I'm phases. Hold on, in that case, hold on. Let me craft my defensive buff. Okay. Does it use any particular element? You said use no particular element, it just spikes you? Pretty much, I think. It might do holy. Maybe a little. Get, I won't bother with holy uh, defense items then. For now, let me just make some more uh, uplifting air. Oh, uh, we are on the time limit. We are? Yeah, because I use my bus and everything. Oh, right. Hmm. All right, let's just go. I've got enough to last us. Say hello to the tree spirit for the shadow tree. Oh, so that's what that was. Huh. Ah, its HP is going. Yeah, its HP is going like a falling like a baby down a staircase. It definitely has multiple phases. And thus begins the zoomies. 
luckily, my uh, summon also has zoomies. It is also summon, taking almost dead. Yeah, it's taking a lot of damage. Oh wow, it dodged. Yeah, you want to get a bit closer too. I'm not sure if it's actually reaching him. But uh, do definitely use that spell. It screws this guy up bad. Look at that damage. That is delicious. Also, he's planning on doing something big and annoying now. Like existing, for one. It needs to stop that. Yep, still weak to fire. And it still will be when it comes uh, up. Okay, near me, yeah, okay, never mind then. Nope, too late. Okay, good night. And good riddance. Remembrance of the Shadow Sunflower. Wait, that no, thing can be close to Huh. Wait, what now? So, you, you both spoke up, I didn't catch either of you. I said I got nearly 400,000 runs out of that. Nice. And you, Alex? Yeah, I was gonna say, wait, what's Mikola's Grey Room doing here? But then I remembered, oh yeah, he threw it away, which is also what caused his uh, spell over everyone to break. Yep. I guess that we need to find the shadow, the tower here then. Nope, there isn't one. Oh, then how do we activate it? You don't. Well, that's no fun. It just gives you protection from being hugged. By what? Make Things that want to hug a little too hard. Uh, that's that's spoilers for the final boss. We already know it's Mikula because it has to be. He's pretty much. It's the... still spoilers for the final boss. Uh, I guess we want to go to the Tree Worship Passage. Or actually, no, let's just go to the second chapel. Uh, I still need to get the thing from the hand statue, though. That is completely in a different region of space and time. Not that bad. I just have to be near the one near the elevator. Then I just dump, jump on it, and if I don't, I just go around again. It's not hard. Where I dropped in from. Yeah, exactly. I did ask about other tabletop systems. And this one's coming to close. Apparently, some interesting stuff with Mouse Guard. Apparently, how Mouse Guard works. Oh yeah. Well, I mean, half our team is rat. It should be. Uh, felt it was an obvious direction to go after. Mm. Uh, nah. Well, I, I would say uh, Starfinder. Isn't that Pathfinder but sci-fi? Yes. Yep. It doesn't like the frenzy play very much, that's for sure. I don't think it liked much of anything we were doing to it. Yeah, it's 
definitely weak to Frenzy Flame. <laughs> Crab, weak to being cooked. Hmm. How did you trouble go with that? Yeah, how'd you go through there, Jasper? I can't. You're just too fat. Uh, what's my excuse then? Too ruggedly broad shouldered? Yeah, I have no idea how you did that. Oh, is it just some kind of jank thing? Uh, you have to uh, get it in a running jump. I'm just going the long way around. That is not the correct kind of a running jump. I mean, I'm holding down the run button. How much more run can I give it? Eh. Yeah, I can't even go from this side of that one. Eh. It almost looked like it was going... Eh, there we go. It went through... And within that time, we could have just gone around. Probably. Yeah, with this boat here, it would almost think you make you think we'd fight a boatman. Hmm. Another way aquatic stuff is some tied to death in this game. Mm hmm. They on, do that a lot. On the TB Mariners, one of the few undead, or are they, des uh, are they uh, live in death as well? They're, I believe, live in death. They're just like. Uh... They also summon those who live in death. Oh, it's a good thing this is going up and not down. That looks pretty watery. Do not like. <laughs> <laughs> and there's your statue. Go nuts. See, it's a good thing we lowered the water. Yep. Okay, it's the back of that thing that we got the item from. Got it. Alright, so I think we got an Iris of Grace. Hold on, I need to try and get back up there to try and get that thing. Mm. We yeah, got there a... it is. Iris of Grace. Did we? I thought we just got Marika's Rune. Nope, we got an Iris of Grace. Huh. Well, the question is, uh, once Alex gets back up here... I'm not leaving until I get that thing. Oh, so we do. And gets this shadow-relevant thing. Aim for the arm. Also, you just went by it. Unless you're just gonna try from the other side, I guess. I've already gotten it. Oh, that I'm was the one that was Ah, there we go. Now you've arrived. Aim for the arm. Got it. Yay. Oops. Alright, so do you want the weapon? Or do you want a new, uh, new spirit summon? What What's the weapon? weapon uh, the weapon is a great. Uh, rape rapier or whatever. Huh. A heavy thrusting sword. It is infusible. And it has innate fire damage on it. It's a faith weapon, isn't it? Uh, it has some faith scaling for the fire, but otherwise it's just normal weapon. I'm not sure how big that would be for my build. If anything, I've been using a lot of uh, spirit ashes lately. So, do you want the spirit ash then? Yeah, yeah, I'd say that. Oh, uh, thanks for the follow, Lunar Blade. I stream just about anything here, so feel free to stop by if something catches your eye. Welcome, welcome. Well, hurry up and get over here. Alright, hold on.
hold on, hold on. Hold all right, hold on. Let me try and get figure out how to get there. Oh yeah, it's this way. Easy. Yeah, normally you do these on tomorrow night, but we had a bit of time today, so we decided to try and get what we can done. Queen Marika, I implore thee, bestow thy grace. Take not from me my soul. Oh, I guess this is one of those we have to be, uh... Which one are we using? Yeah, I'm um... using the Iris of Grace. Oh, do we each get to pick our own? Oh, thanks. Yeah, I'm stuck here. Hmm. Huh, weird. But well, congratulations on your fire night, Quicklin. Oh, it's not Queenlin? I'm stuck. You might have to roll back me or something. <laughs> Throw a grenade! That usually works. <laughs> wait, wait. Not Helldivers. I never did play that. I don't think I've seen someone stuck this long before. Uh, yeah, it's probably just gonna keep going until he, like, is able to come back in. You're probably just gonna have to miss us and let us come back in. Yeah, unfortunately. Uh, the, for the record, the avatar artist is credited in my panels at the bottom. Paris, that's our Twitter handle. That's our usual handles. You have been kicked. And when you are brought back, you will be in a whole new world. Right. Alright, while well, I'm here, I can upgrade the new Spirit Ash. See how that works. I haven't reopened it. Yep, it's open again. Okay. Connecting. Summoned, Spirit of Night granted relief by the Iris of Grace. Will the Spirit of Grace sword impales on fire, keeping their taint of impurity away? Actually, you know what? Uh, go to the uh, High Road Cross. Okay. Because there's going to be a bug oh. we want to kill. I'm going to want to grab a drink real quick. <clears throat> After all the ones we've been sparing in this one. I just heard something die. What died? This sheep. It even dropped Imperium blood. So I think That's I just killed the god of all sheep. <laughs> or, you know, just picked it up near the cross. Uh, no, it actually dropped it. Oh well. Those guys don't 
They do not. <laughs> Came over and smacked the stone with my sword. I was definitely useful there. <laughs> Okay, cool. They can just combo the fuck out of you. Love it. Except I totally don't. Eat spiral bitches. They don't even play our models, so I can't frenzy flame them. Well, I mean, you can still burn them, you just can't make them go crazy. After all, they're already crazy enough to believe in the Golden Order. Yeah, the madness thing only seems to be more PvP than anything, it feels like. The stats effect, I mean. Like you said, everything mm. still burns. Well, I mean, when you do the uh, invasion things on NPCs, it's still helpful there. Because those are usually something you can slaughter with it. I guess that is true. That does just make it basically babby PvP though, so shrug. I guess to the credit, a number of major enemies do have player models. Mm. Especially for a quest line where at the end of them they decide to fight you for whatever reason. Mm. I did not like you. Yeah, I didn't see the one hit in the tent. Alright, there's a bug around here somewhere we gotta find. Bug. Oh boy, Somber Six. Nope, there it is. Huh? Broken room. That's you. You're over this way. Okay. Ah. One of those. Anything right, else now was, let's oh head boy, for yeah. the uh, main gate plaza. And you're gonna want to put rolling sparks into your uh, into your little perfumer flask. Rolling sparks. It's the new thing we just picked up. First of all, let's increase the blessing here. Which one's it called again? It'll be the bottom one that's more colorful than the others. It's uh, Rolling Sparks or something like that. What's that? I genuinely don't see it. Hmm. Because you are blind. There's only like five options for the perfumers, Seth. Oh, now the mixed physique. Never mind. Sadly, uh, it got nerfed from how it was originally when it released. Because the reason you could just point it straight at the ground and do thousands of damage. Huh. Horn Sun fight. 
Yeah, we'll probably want to do that solo. Yeah. If Alex ever figures out how to make, uh, do his thing. Sparkle, sparkle. Need to figure it out, Alex. No, Paul's figure out as I go along. Is it a mixed physic or a perfume? It's in the perfumer bottle. We said it like five times already. Ashavor for your frenzy flame flasks. Oh, the fr frenzy flame. Fl okay. Yes, I'm perfumer sorry. bottle. They're perfumer bottles. All right, let me equip that. Hold on. Oh, get back up here, cause there's a. We'll just go here. I didn't realize it was an ash of war. Boop. Huh. I debated some sort of interaction with the mall before, I don't mind it, but I have been one. Oh, I can do it here. I have been wondering. I don't want to be. This place again. Basically, I don't want to have those uh, redeems where it's like. Make Watch those out for the little dreamers guys. scream or stuff like that, since uh, I try to be a bit more laid back in that. I'm worried about the. Well, all of them, really. Big little in between. Fuck them all! Also, watch out for Anzbok. I mean, he's off in his own room. We should be okay on that one. Alright, I applied it. What does it do? This. Oh, it allows you to shoot it out. That's neat. Yep, hit control. Couple. Ooh, that's really good. Yep. Squats in. Ada. Alright, watch out for Jar guys. Like that one. He was no match for our stink foo. So, fun fact about this place, uh, they're trying to rehabilitate and maybe find a way to cure the jar people. So, oh, I see. These are all Ashes of War specifically for perfumer bottles. Yep. That's neat. I'm glad they didn't get stuck with not being able to do much like whips. Be a nice way to heal without needing to use MP. They use FP. It just does it slowly. Oh well, that's annoying. Got 
got bored. All right, there's like a mini boss guy up here. I like you can take uh, care of that guy coming up behind us. Firing. So what's the mini boss? That was the mini boss. Oh. It does more if uh, you're in melee. Hmm. Oh, there's our other Iris of Grace. That's the end of the hallway on the other side. Right, I forgot everything they every single thing they do is horrifying. Yep. And that's why the horn scent deserved it. like hold up hold up no it's worse than boss time we have to sit and listen to a lecture time uh no it's uh if you fall behind you die time So don't stop to fight anything, and don't stop to pick anything up. <laughs> Mashy as you go. Got it. Ah, right. Because we got this guy. thought maybe uh I hear I thought it was because the bridge would fall apart behind us like the And now we can go do killing and looting. <laughs> That's one of those super fun spells that uh completely sucks when you get it. Yep. It is absolutely fucking awful, but of course the enemies can use things from fifty miles away from you. That that and it's bugged. Yeah. Uh, it only does like single digit damage. Oh, wow. I knew it was bad. I didn't know it was that bad. Oh, crap. So how are the finger sorceries now that you've been using them a bit? Eh. At least they home. Shadow Realm Rune. Well, they are bats. Yep. Bats drop those. Bats and rats. Rats seem to have a really good loot table if you're lucky. If you're lucky. Still better than most enemies, where even the greatest amount of luck won't make them do any drop anything good. Hmm. That kind of depends on your definition of good.
technically this is the way you're supposed to go after you beat Mesmer. But like with... Oh. But like with Rey Lucario, you can skip it? Uh, no, you can't actually skip Mesmer. I mean, skip... You'll have to fight him eventually. Right, but... You... I mean, you can go around to go to the other area past it. What the bacon ever do to you? Has too much HP. Spirit <laughs> calculus. Crap, it's making me do calculus. Damn it, they know I failed the first time around, so they're bringing. They know it's my one weakness. <laughs> These things have 2000 HP. Get off, Mark. I've had bad experiences trying to have torrent on elevators. It does not go well. <laughs> well, Madness may not be able to drive the tarnish, non tarnish insane, but can at least shred their poise a good bit. Mm hmm. This, the eh, let's kill these guys. It's what they deserve. Oh uh, yeah, another one of the little uh, blood cult sections, huh? But a horrifying thing to make a cult around, which is different from my horrifying cult because screw you. Yeah, I'm going for the frenzied flame ending with this particular run, so. Doing a bit of a jack of all trades build with a focus on decks. Slade, you know, there's using the. Uh, is doing Unfortunately, the trying to use this poison arcane stuff just isn't doing too well. And no. Jasper, uh, Arden, yeah, always he's... never seems to proc. Hmm. Jasper, yeah, might Adrian. just be the shit's dying too fast for it to do so. Uh, yeah. Uh, Jasper, Adrian here, he rebuilt, he respects pretty often to try on new stuff, so. It's hard to pin down a specific what specific build he's doing. Wait a minute, isn't this? Oh, yeah, we want to go down this way. I'm pretty sure that's the spot. What, you mean over here? Yeah. Because if I remember correctly, oh, that should be... Yeah, Hippo. Well, not so golden. Yeah, well, no. still a hippo. <laughs> still terrible at catching torrent. <gasps> Give us our fragments. This time. Yeah, it did die like a little bitch. I suppose it was only a uh, worth one fragment boss. I didn't even get a boss uh, thing at the bottom. It was just a regular enemy from my end. Yeah. Yeah, it was basically a mini boss, basically. It really was. What was its name? It doesn't have a name, it's just a mini boss. No, it had not yet it. earned its name. I think this one's just a dead end. Yeah, I think you gotta go back up top. Hmm. But you always have to check Waterfall, and that one is another disappointment failure. Plenty of dogs for the next, though. I mean... If you're into that sort of thing. Raw burrow. What are the raws that these are burrows of? 
An ancient civil civilization. Of ants? That apparently predated both the, uh, Horn Sand and Golden Order. Well, there's a handful that do. I mean, the dragons certainly do. No, the Golden Order is actually somewhat recent. Yeah. The air trees had so much horrible change. More spirit calculus. Man, man bro, bro, these are pretty tiny. Have to look at the item description, see if it tells us anything interesting. A relic found in the ancient ruins of Ra. It was once inhabited by a spirit. <laughs> it was no match for fire and ice. And giant BD club. I'm not entirely sure what kind of a build uh, Jasper's doing. I think he respects even. Yeah, I just had to trap poison because of this uh, weapon I got. Or the Ash of War. Make it to the middle. Is there anything That's in the fine. middle? Uh, no. You can find out. There's an item down here, though. All in stone and an antiquity scholar's cookbook. Also, another mushroom. Oh, also, come over here. Oh. You're doing a bad job of coming over here. Well, it's been a while since you've actually been throwing heals, so, you know. Cause one dwelling Plus, I wasn't looking your direction, so I didn't know what over here was even at. Or for. Gotta work on that communication. Sorry, I was reading the descriptions. What were we saying? Uh, which one of us? Uh, let's start with your stuff, because, like I said, after I got the spot, fair stones and bond stone stuff in the recipe book, I was reading over what they do. Ah. So yeah, I was a little distracted. Hmm. Mostly just our usual back and forth about him being too vague and, uh, my running around not paying attention. Got the pot in his head. Mm hmm. Need to sneak up on him. Sadly, he dropped nothing good. Nor does this one. Did 
just some spirit calculus. Some dew gems. Hmm. So we're going to the vent next. Yep. It is now an immersive sim. Because you go through vents. <laughs> Look, I'm one of those annoying things from Lyurnia. Oh, beware the mist! <laughs> Whereas this thing is just being annoying about running around. That's it. That was a good snipe. Sometimes you just have to do that. Favorite guys. Sparkle, sparkle. I feel there's a shadow tree fragment over here. Which one? Oh, that explains it. <laughs> I thought don't fall in the to do hole. that a lot. <laughs> don't fall in the hole yet. Anything good on the balcony? Nope. very well. It was kind of janking up and down. Eh, I guess it's dead. Probably fell through the terrain. Or just burned. Who knows? The better question is, who cares? As long as it's dead. And now you can summon your own spider scorpions. If ever you're feeling that insane. They seem like they could be annoying, but they also don't have much HP, so I can't imagine they'll last. Well, there's a difference between enemy ones and summoned ones. Yeah, the enemy ones will try.
Huh, I think this is all that's out here. Apparently so. Well, now it's still far down that hole. <laughs> I have no idea what these are, but something tells me I'm going to want this stomach. Hmm. Uh. Which way is the thing again? Over here. Uh. Over here where? You're the one who ran up. Also, if you fall a little bit to the side, you might land on something. Of which there's nothing here. Next one down. A red cap mushroom. Oh boy, red flesh mushroom. Worth my time. Red caps aren't everywhere. Get the item up here. Rude. Didn't you know those things had a grab attack? Oh, yeah. They can uh, chain spam it on you, too. Uh, was there anything else under here? Nope. Okay. Back steps to increase steps to Crucible 2.0. Sadly, she doesn't drop anything good. Crucible Hammer Helm. She was just an excuse to add a centaur to the game. 
I had more abilities that you can't get to the game. You know how it is with them Crucible Knights. Always pulling shit out. Ah, yes, more dry leaf art. Oh boy, the last of the flesh of his body. Hey, message left by the office compatriots. Message left by dry leaf Dane. Address Touch. the kindred spirits. Prepare Mikla's trail. Found the skeetling tree just ahead before burn. I said first. Maybe. What'd say? I was asking him if we were gonna set or not. Which is good. I guess we uh, can level up our shadow blessing. Mm-hmm. Fourteen. Level up in general looks like. Not bad. Sweet. Hmm. Granted, we don't have to kill these guys. Ow. Probably should have killed that guy, though. Fuck. Yeah, we were stuck on a bridge that if we jumped off, we'd die, and if we stay, we died. We were between a rock and a hard place. Yep. Yeah, I genuinely did not see that guy. He definitely saw us. Isn't there a different bridge to go over to get at him? Uh, there will be a perch that we can go to. Will be? You have to activate it or something? We have to get to it first. Yeah, I also need to get my runes. Mm. Yeah, we oh, don't need me to too. do that. Me too. Believe me, I'm not leaving these behind. Not yet. There Are we go. How are we up? Yep. yep. He's a fire in his laser. Over our heads, luckily. Man, if my Comet Azur could only fucking do that. Does he even have a range limit on that? No. Mm, yes, technically. <laughs> Not one that's going to be appreciable enough to escape from. Anyway, there should be a spirit spring yes. rest. Yep. We just got to... Yeah. Welcome to the Spirit Spring. If you have at least like five different places to go, I oh, went the wrong one. I jumped, but I couldn't. I guess I must have instantly double jumped or something because it wouldn't let me, and I didn't make it to the spring. Hmm. I wonder, can I what the fuck chuck from here? Hey, if only he would get a little bit closer. What? Oh, apparently my idiot throws it, like, forward instead of up. I think with this much level in intelligence that he would actually be able to figure out how to throw a throwing arc. Mean like that? I'm like what? I didn't see you throw it, so. I mean, yeah. I see the result of it, which, you know, good, yay. But I didn't see the throw, so I can only assume that, yeah, Sears figured it out. At least they took care of it, so I'm gonna have to. Motherfucker. You better land on that spirit spring. Good. Wretched fucking murder horse. Anything up there? 
Done yep. it. There's a ring you can get. Or a talisman, I guess. Uh. Where? Oh, uh, you chest. probably already got it because you opened the chest. Oh, you guys are up on that one. I thought it came up this side. Raises all stash essences. Which the talisman then, huh? Yep. Oh dear, are you doing the first floor? Ah! Huh. What is Alex doing? Uh, he was trying to get in the spirit spring and for some reason it's still murdering him. You. Uh, the most obnoxious orc that has like five fuck billion more health than it should. Uh, also, oh, so two for some reason, uh, instead of getting up on my horse, it just kept on changing weapons. Oh wow, that's rude. No, no, I don't want it targeted. Thanks. Yes, I see. I have an item. Please fuck off. <laughs> Ooh, yeah, I don't want to target. Fuck you. Auto targeting bullshit trying to fucking kill me. Now then. Why does this hate you, Alex? Oh yeah, stuck in a wall. Great. Hey, oh. Yeah, 180. Yeah, I gotta love it when enemies can do those. Oh yeah, they turn on a dime. Meanwhile, you have a turn speed that can be buffed and debuffed. Yep. And you can be comboed for five fuck billion times. Yeah, I don't know what it is with this orc, but it is ridiculously more tanky than the others. It's basically a mini boss without being a mini boss. Kind of horseshit is what I'm saying. Oh, there we go. Oh. And it doesn't even drop you anything. Nope. Well, after all, it's just a regular creature. Just a totally innocent little guy. Definitely not harder than the other orcs at all. Now maybe I can see how Alex is constantly dying. Oh, you're actually alive. Yeah, is there anything you missed down here? Uh, not there. What's your favorite status?
I think we want to go down here. Okay. Stay over here, Alex. You're not doing a too good job of staying over here, Alex. Never mind. Where? Damn it, Torrent. Stop being so weak. Doesn't the app Shadow Ash Blessing increase Torrent's HP? It's yeah, his HP, to. not his usefulness. And it still doesn't matter if he's just going to get one shot all the time. Yeah. Kind of like with us. We can at least dodge. Torrent just dies. Hmm. There is that. Oh good, the flying version. Number one. <laughs> uh. These giant flowers look suspicious. Oh, uh, that's because they're the things that, uh, the rock guys leave behind. feel so bad now. I didn't think I was doing much damage to those, but the Frenzied Flame was doing less, which is weird. Then again, I suppose it does have, like, what, four different attributes that it fucking goes off of? All of them. Yeah, pretty Basically. Much. And Alex doesn't really have anything that's not melee. That's a nice poison field you got there. Too bad you're still immobile. Feel good about that. That was a good softening. Kind of a garden, with garden without a little pruning. Just make sure you rip off its head. And now you get the ability to do that whole big giant laser thing. Yep. You can call and down the probably suck. Yeah. The glowy lights of Pew Pew. Which is basically what this entire lower section was for. Getting that. And that somber one. Oh, yes, yeah, true. I can't leave out that kind of valuable loot. Be very remiss of me. Now, at this point, I'm not even bothering to use uh, activated Pot. great rune. What? Pot. Pot guy. Feared Spirit Ash. Yay. Well, hopefully there wasn't anything else up there. Because we can't go back anymore? No, we can. We just have to drop down, call the elevator, and go back on. But I don't remember if there was anything there. So, I don't know. What the? What the heck do that? <laughs> well, that was interesting. I summoned Dorant and it just immediately died. I wasn't sure if that appeared on was just my screen or appeared on yours too. Yeah. Did it make you use a uh, a flask to give yes. Brandon back? 
Yes, it did. Amazing. Did you guys get the knot resin? You want to clean up after Blythe? Couple pillars back. You can't see it on the way in because of the fact that uh, it's on the other side of the pillars. It was down there on a body. Blythe did that one three times. I'd threatened to stab well, I think you, we're almost at the boss fight. I don't use uh, those swords anymore. <laughs> and what would you be stabbing me for? Hmm, yeah, come right at me. Great idea. Most of the enemies in the DLC are smarter than that. Oh, and here's one that does uh, explosions in the ground. Cool. Well, you said you wanted one smarter. That's one is definitely smarter. I said I was surprised that it wasn't smarter. I'm perfectly fine with it being dumb. I just, you know, prefer Himbo as opposed to dumb jackass. Ritualistic gazebo. Hmm. I suppose it is an isolated area. Back where we started. No, we're not. There's a different spot. Because there's another shadow tree fragment. Want to say no to more of those? What are you going to say no to bouncy lightning? Or bouncy fireballs? High fire is lucky for me. Hot enemy. Did you get him? Yeah, I got him. Okay. Oh, he is in a completely different area from us. He just went back out to go wander around the square. It's because I was getting I shot at by the fire dudes and I wanted to get rid of them or else they'd be a problem. You mean like this person? Yes. Yeah. Precisely. Fires. Right. This is. Oh, lovely. Oh, that must they have a died. flame of death. Hmm? Thanks, Torrent. Credit to team. Now, if only I could kick a corpse. Got raided, one sec. Hot enemy is over here. Looks like you're playing Minecraft. Hope you had a good time there. Yeah, I had spirit count you. Welcome, welcome. Yeah. Just doing an extra night yeah, I said of... that earlier when I picked it up. I'm doing an extra night of a Shadow of the Air Tree with my buddies here, as you can see. We're exploring the ruins, seeing what other nice things are available. So, uh, when you say we're almost to the boss, uh, which one? Oh, I have no idea. Oh. You haven't done bosses in this place? Yep, I've done all, most of them, I think. Hmm. That's probably Romano, Romana, whatever. Hmm. <laughs> Romane. We stream it tomorrow night as well. A hey, boss so... is apparently extremely important that, uh, you just get nothing for. Hmm. He's even lore. in the freaking trailer. You at least get lore? Kinda. Barely. Do you remember any of the uh, stories of the uh, uh, woman learning from the blue fairy? 
vaguely. Hmm. Uh, do you remember what the antagonist was in that story? The blue fairy? N no, the, the blue fairy was doing the teaching. I'm a, my mind's in a completely different place because I was talking with Tarth about uh, fairy prophecies and how they tend to get you. Well, you'll see when we hit the boss then. Alrighty. Well, I guess I could bring that up warrior. Are either of you familiar with Percy Jackson? Yes. Vaguely. Uh, Books remember? were okay, the movie just failed on its face so hard. Yeah, I'm told the movie only works as a standalone. Yep. They basically took the plot of all five books and went, let's just finish it in the first one. Yeah, that sounds like it have a lot of problems. Yeah. Anyway, do you remember the one prophecy where it says something like the Half-Blood will fight and then the hero falls that where it's supposed to make you think that uh, Percy is both the hero and the Half-Blood, but in reality it's two separate people? Yep. Yeah, that's how they get you. It is. If it do uses they two different prophecies. terms... Yeah, if it ever uses two separate terms, that is two separate phrases. Matter of yeah. fact, this is back where we started. Yep. Oh, so now... Okay, so I was a bit early, and it's now when we do the full circle. Oh, uh, so which way are we going this time? Uh, we need to go through the uh, rotted area. Okay. Is that the area I am, or a different one? Here. Oh, so it's completely wrong. Yep. You want to take the spirit spring and come uh, north. You'll probably rub up against the wall a bit, but don't worry about that. Just uh, use your double jump when you get down here. There we are. And one of them's already coming out to say hello. Let's give them a good greeting, shall we? I want to see what's in the greater potentate's cookbook. It's too Hefty late. Rot pot. I mean, I can see what it does, I just can't craft it. Oh, this is at the point blank AoE. That's useless. Yep. I hadn't seen it before, but uh, now that I have, yeah, that's, um, that's fucking worthless. Yeah, that would actually be worth considering if, you know, you could aim it at a specific target like you could, like the plants do. Where is this even aiming? I had the left one targeted, and it threw that shit to the right. I believe we're pretty I close can't. to getting. Yep, I definitely want those. Hmm. Those in your spiral shard will uh, make easy work of, maybe, the uh, yeah. stompy boys, the golems. Maybe. <laughs> yeah. There's the a lot of maybe in there, yes. In, swamp in every game. Even Sekiro had a poison swamp, and that was technically a period piece taking place during the Warring States area of Japan. Because apparently Japan had poison swamps back then. I think we want to continue this way for the pest threads. Not take the uh, elevator? Not yet. I love it when you can show the enemies what it's like to get swarmed and ganked like that. Yeah, and not so fun when they're the victim of it, huh? Unfortunately. Nope, nope, this is uh, the gazebo. I guess we do want to take the elevator now. Huh. Yep.
I think it has like a couple paths up there too. Running around. <laughs> You'll be waiting a long damn time for that. <laughs> uh, that was a lot. Of nothing really huh. I do like how the Freemer bottle hitbox lingers a bit. Hmm. Me too. Scarlet Bud. I think those are for the hefty rot pots. Yep. There's the Pestoid Spears. Oh, cool. What happened? Uh, I had gotten Scarlet Rotted. Uh oh. Yeah, that's insane. Oh, wait, now you can use the Pest Thread Spears. Yeah, Scarlet Rod is an absolutely crippling status effect to be hit by. Deals something like 25, what, 25% your maximum HP in, da in upfront damage, and then a huge dot after. And now I gotta find the way back up there. Uh, just do the Spirit Spring up to the uh, Rot thing again. Or you have a different grace, huh? Oh, luckily like I'm the other spirit spring. Oh, okay, good. We're out at the gazebo near the uh, way in. I'll grab a sip of my drink while you're uh, while we're waiting. Hmm, good idea. Some spare time that lets me regen. Hmm. Also, he's back in here. Oh, he's back. back yeah, he again. came through the uh, other side of it there. So, you were starting to do that kind of a reference. Was there anything fun down here? I don't know. We're just going to poke enemy. our heads out. There's a big enemy over there. The one that looks oh, like. Oh, it's just a bird. Bird? Yeah, bird. Boyd! Nine bird feathers. The one you, you just were farming? demonstrated the spell. Like the one you were farming? Yep. Uh, ever reliable torrent. Reliable, the motherfucker's dead. I don't think we want to go that way. Probably not. The way we want to go is actually up. Mm. We just died. Though we also have an option for down. I don't know. Something probably fell somewhere. Oh uh, yeah, for that elevator leads to. Hmm. Uh, that we've actually already been through. We just didn't take the elevator up. Oh, we already went there. Then yeah, there's no need, no need to go back. Uh, I'm not looking at the elevator. Yeah, no. 
but that's where we've been. Is it now? Hmm. I mean, you could be right, but I f think we haven't been here. Because hey. down there is a path. Uh, is it there? Or... Ah, there's a part way to land on under there, I think. Or is that the same height as the uh, stuff down there? This all seems to be the same height. Oh, okay. That was not worth the risk. What was it? Four toad foul foot. Three of them. Fuck all that. Oh, that was too close. Yep. Well, there's an elevator right here. Should be a grace, too. Oh, there's also a, uh, what's it called, a vent. Yep. Which means, an, which means another area unloads into here. Yep. I believe that's the path we're going to right now. Hmm. Uh, sure. Okay, again. Torrent. Yep. Torrent just been like dying again. Uh, apparently that's just his thing today. He just wants to keep on dying. Whereas I just want to keep my goddamn flasks. Probably over here. To get to the golem, or oh, hey, uh, how much do you like Deathblight? Should I equip the Prince of Death's Postule? That's uh, not gonna help. Yeah, yeah, I probably won't. Um, if I remember correctly, around here should be uh, our second fight with the Divine Beast. Probably down here. Probably, because I'm not seeing it up on this one. Oh, that's just an elevator. Okay. I think that's the, yeah, that's the way we came up. Oh. Yep. That's my sense so of energy geology. Looks like I mean, there's literally line. a stairway right next to a. Oh, hello. Oh, well, there it is. I suppose it makes sense being the grand stairway. So vitality is uh, protection from death, like right? Yes, yep. vitality and nothing else, unfortunately. And there are no items that boost your defense to it. Just the talisman. For what little good that can do. Okay, there's a big grumpy golem over there. Oh yeah, yeah, we, we are going to need to take him out too. But there's an item over here. More spirit calculus. Boy. Hmm. Apparently you can shoot pretty far out. Oh, apparently he can just shoot straight down too. Despite not even aiming that way. Hmm. Uh, go around it, Alex. Down this way. There's dogs down there. Is 
sparkle, sparkle. Once again, didn't need us at all. Sparkle, sparkle. <laughs> I don't worry, if he died, he'd have complained that we weren't there fast enough. down here more. And I do believe that that might be his arena there? It looks right. So need to put on some armor that's good with uh, vitality. Let me yep. also equip some carrying boluses. <laughs> you fought this guy, Jasper? Nope. Cool. I showed you something new. Yay. I knew of him, though. Just... Mm. Not where? Yep. Basically. Still, should do something new, yay! It might not help, but at the same time, I, I want everything I possibly can. I know even if this, the Prince of Death doesn't really help, I still would rather have it than nothing, especially since so little things can buff it. Hmm. Like, there's no beef jerky that will buff your vitality for some reason. Probably don't have a uh, black solution that can be considered medicinal. Even the rainbow one that raises everything doesn't raise it. Mm hmm. Multicolored, unfortunately, does not include black. Black is just at the far end of the spectrum of every color. It's theoretically the. Oh, he's already wandering around down there. Yep, he uh he dances around. He's a little dancey dance. Also, he summons a death dealing bas basilisk, so uh, be wary of that. Oh yeah, yeah, adds. Lovely. Yeah. I. Don't know if we have a softer place to land or not. What matters is, do this kill us? Find out. Up. That's fine. Didn't even take fall damage. Yep. It can be hard to tell in this game sometimes. <sighs> Well, that definitely heard a bell. Don't drag him outside, please. Recast idiot, I'm not holding the button for my health. If it helped your health, though. It would. I'd be one crazily fucking healthy person. Ads are in. Beware of Basilisk. Well, my summon is very aggressive, that's for sure. Good. Uh, you want to get out of there? Yep, the dance of death has begun. 
Oh, what the hell? What? I got into a spot that didn't have any, and it just kept on taking it. Oh. That's why I love preferred the rejuvenating boluses on hand. On... Yeah, I had them too, but it didn't matter, because uh, if you can't see the graphic, it doesn't matter if you have them or not. Where the hell is it even going? Because it's still trying Giant. to find Jasper. This is after me, after I started burning it. As you do. Yeah. Please tell me it spawned in a, uh, grace. Mm. I'd love to, but it would be a lie. Unless I'm just missing it somewhere, but I'm not seeing any swirly gold anywhere. You? Not here, but I guess I can keep searching. Hmm. I'm... Pretty sure that this thing is supposed to be the, uh... I think it's the way that we exit from that uh, one little window thing. Or maybe that was a different path. Hmm. That was a different path. Of course, in case we can just ah. jump off here, I guess. Ah, uh, yeah. I think that's, uh... Oh, yeah, that's the place that we, uh... Remember when we first got to see this area? That's the place we teleported into. Oh, huh. Yep. So I think we just warped back from here. Uh, which should be... Which one do we want to go to? Well, the one I can set off immediately is the Raw Ancient Ruins East, and that would just revive Jasper. He might end up having to spawn the other one because, yeah, he's uh, dropped his runes. Hmm. Right, we have to actually sit to revive him for some reason. I'm still loading in. Well, luckily there is a stake in America. Good. That should make it easier. So much closer, oh god. <laughs> So if that's the last of his body, does that mean he basically did what Ronnie did, discarding her body to... Nah, she did hers a little differently. She did hers very differently. Technically, losing her body was an accident. Mm, no. No, it wasn't her. Purpose. Yeah, it was the plan. She wanted to keep her soul, which is why she let Godwin take the soul death and she took the uh, body death. Now, let's see if we can remember how the fuck to actually get to the damn boss. Okay, good. The fire golem didn't respond. Uh, we probably don't want to go there, then. If we want to go to that one place. To which one? The place with the thing, obviously. Isn't Ravine North down below, though? Yep, but I'm pretty sure it's not Ancient Road East. Hmm. We only warp there just to revive you, for the record. That, and you can go across to the Spirit Spring again, but there's probably something else we can get to from here. Ancient Ruins West it is. Yep, it's West. So we need to get back to our elevator. Oh, nope, it's not west. Ravi I thought you said no? Ravine North. Oh, we're going to the Grand Star, right? We're just warping all over, aren't we? It's a regular maze. Yeah, ancient. Yep, the Grand Stairway. Stretch, stretch. <sighs> well, you know how it is with those Tarnished. I always like playing Whack-A-Mole. Oh, believe me, I'm very grateful for the quick travel options. It's genuinely hmm. fun exploring the world, but uh, if you have to retread the same ground over and over, it just wouldn't be fun. Elevator's waiting on you, Alex. All 
I was looking around to try and find where you were. Alright, because we can just continue on with Torrent trying to murder us the whole way. Fucking horse. Don't worry, I sent the elevator back up. You can use it immediately. Thanks. Alright, if anyone asks, I did intentionally. I totally There's didn't accidentally. Like panicking on a horse. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a waste of goddamn plus, some goddamn torrent. Where one of these days I'm gonna have a goddamn heart attack trying to ride that thing. Mm. That's the famous Where's off camera. Fuck did it put my rings? It's usually from before you began jumping, I guess. That's what I would have thought too, but it looks like they put them upstairs somewhere. I guess the elevator ride didn't count or something? That's oh. a lot. It... It put them right over by the grace? The fuck? That's not supposed to be the right place at all. That's where you want them to be. Well, uh, while we wait on Slade, I'm gonna be right back. Giant massive and mm -hmm. crucible attributes reduces damage taken, crits, headshots, improves effectiveness of rolling it <sighs> Also increases damage taken all times. Rumored to have spread among giants as known as the mother Fuck, of all the puzzles. puzzles and goddamn Ancient. tall ass ruins. Another one of the worst places to have a fear of heights. Most definitely. I guess I might as well go over mm. there and be a beacon for him, so he knows where to go. Hate this place. Fucking hate this place so much. I figure I should hang okay. back and be a beacon so you know where to go, because this is hidden the foliage, as you can see. Hmm. Foliage. Foliage? Hmm. And here's mm. where we get dumped. Oh yes, Jasper's in bird mood today. I mean, he kind of changes fashion like every five minutes while we're playing the game. Well, they do say fashion is true in game. Mm-hmm. Thought they do. Smashy, smashy. Hmm. It appears it favors my right side attack more than the left side attack. I was hitting both and seeing what it would do. Uh, he stepped out for a moment, so he'll be back in a minute. Mm-hmm. From here, is it? No. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> All right, I'm back. Welcome back. Now we can go to Romanov.
And I think we want to go back down the stairway. Thanks to him. Well, that was fast. Oh, Sadly, he is levitating above the ground. Hmm. That's okay, though. He's got to move those ankles sometime. And then I cut them off. Whoa, gold great bow dropped. Whoa. I only got great arrows. Those are pretty good, it's just hard to get them on mass. They actually do heal AoE damage. Nice. Take America, and you know what that means. Yeah, I was the one for the Divine Beast. Oh, never mind then. We didn't really see anything to go to from down there, though. Yeah, I had thought I'd seen it when uh, we were first over there. Hmm. But yep. That would mean back up to the Ruin East, I think, or maybe Ruin West. I just remember we have to get back to that place where we had all the bugs and the staircase going up. So I know it's that yep. way, I just don't remember how the hell to get to that. I don't have this place quite that memorized. I must only just remembered some of what I did today from playing it the like yesterday. All we have to do is find the bugs. Mm hmm Which probably means going back to the estate. Uh with the cross. I mean, don't we want to just go over to the spirit spring here again and go along that way? Oh, there it is. Unfortunately, all the bugs will be back. Well, we don't have to deal with them. Just jump over this direction, and don't go on the cliff on the top. Just aim for the part below it. And now I'm past all the bugs. Yeah, but that's not the correct way to get to the boss, I don't think. Mm. Hmm. I thought that goes up and around to their spot. Because I know they've got tunnels in there, but isn't there like something on this side that we came out from too, near a gazebo? Like... That was the other gazebo. Uh... Sneak in extra gazebos and I see, I see. Well... Oh, hey. Oh, we... Here we are. <laughs> I did it. <laughs> I think we want to go up this elevator. That would make sense. Oh. And it turns out, no, we did not want to take this elevator. It actually leads to death as it crushes Wait, us. Wait, how did you fall off? Uh, I was trying to roll away from the pest thread thing incoming, and apparently there's a slight gap. I want to send, send that back the elevator down. back down for you. Thank you! I was pretty sure I was going to die there, but, uh... Hmm, hmm. Ow, apparently it'll almost only be from the bug rather than a fall. Here, here! Drink, drink, motherfucker, drink! Ow! Revenge! 
Flesh. Okay, now that I'm done having several heart attacks today, let's go up the goddamn stairs. Or I keel over fucking dead. There's the bathroom. It was that close the entire time. We could have killed the entire time and been out of here. It doesn't look like there's anything back here. Yeah, Scarlet Bud. That's about it. It's just more and more a disappointment. Well, it's about to get very much not disappointing and very much oh god oh god or everything. Uh, to answer my earlier question when I was saying about the uh, story of the fairy and all that stuff the thing that they were fighting against was a scorpion ah uh, yes the scorpion and uh, they decided to screw over both itself and the one ferrying it across the water just to be an asshole Mm, it would probably be nicer if it was that scorpion. This one is much worse. Well, I am going for full lightning. Cool. I think I'll try the shard spiral thing. I'm not sure how well the uh, Commodore would actually catch her. So, Alex or Alex? Like I mean, it's kind of a bit of both. Say hello to the originator of the Scarlet Rot. I thought, uh, that, not was, I, I thought that was uh, Melania. Mm -mm. No. This thing was here way before she existed. And it, also, again, technically not. Oh? This was a regular person. It even has Millennia's move. Well, at least it seems to be a big enough critter that the Shard Spire was doing pretty well on it. I thought Lightning did pretty good. Mm -hmm. Doesn't seem to like fire too much either. All the stuff that kills bugs dead. Uh, but yes, technically she appears in the opening uh, movie. Okay, that's got to be close enough that I can just use some frickin' runes. Uh, I thought we should probably head back to the uh, round table. Considering we have like four remembrances to use, yeah. We really probably should. But what's up here? A tree we gotta burn. But we hate trees. Can confirm, already blew up the other one. Supposed to be like an item or something. I don't know. I see. <sighs> Time to sell rune cookies until I can stop that heart attack. See the bud, the scarlet glaive with a dangling bud like blade attacks the lip of rot. Once in the crumbling burning church, Romana held the bud in a speech of silence. That bud would become her blade, imbues it with a scarlet rot butterflies from unleashing two large sweeping slashes. This is once considered a sacred act of purification. Not quite. Incantation used by. Ooh. That should be. Summons do it, a though. myriad. 
Myriad butterflies while performing a gentle twirl. They break apart on contact, scattering rot and setting off a chain reaction. Uh, oh, let me know when I can uh, poke the table. Well, the goddess of rot's wings, bereft of a mask. Uh, give me just a minute. Romana, yep. Who reached out to them. Strike weapon. Colossal weapon. Shadow sunflower headbutt. Slam down the shockwave to flatten. Repeat and puts a lot of two follow-ups. The head of a mysterious shadow sunflower manifestation of this shadow tree. Yadu tree. Him. Then again, it might just be a flower wielded as a weapon. Much like the tree itself in appearance, all the right, stalk winds tightly around the first. You got two, Alex? Second stock. Yeah, all I'm doing is looking at the uh, remembrances here. I'm not actually buying anything yet. Just check okay. them out. Oh, she's actually in the right position now. That's good. 148 runes left. Yay. I'm gonna go see if there's anything fun I can get out of this shit. Oddly, I can't talk to her. Huh. Weird. She's talking to me. She got pissed off, huh? Hmm. Potency of storms. Interesting. And a shadow or a colossal faith weapon. And don't really give a shit about either of those. What about you? Rotten butterflies. Faith spell. Fooey. I think that's one you, uh, Jasper was recommending. I guess. What? Did you poke the table? Nope. Yep. Grr. I'm over in Gideon's room. Uh, if you're looking at any of this stuff uh, from the remembrances, absolutely none of them will probably be any good for you. Probably not, but I was still in the middle of it and got kicked out of the menu and can't talk to her now. Same thing happened to me. Uh, you always have to teleport back to the wrong table. I just have to set the table. You, Remembrance Lord, give me power. Hmm. I took the scout tree as a whole blade of the bud. First, almost as if interesting, interesting, interesting. Land of shadow causes scarlet rot buildup. Creates a hail of golden yes, projectiles to fire towards foes after a brief delay. Cows it's an arcane weapon, though, I'm pretty sure. By shadow. Oh, it sure is. Rage, Divine Beast, a charm depicting coveting the dance of Divine Beast, raises the potency of storms. Divine Beast messages of the heavens in their rage mirrors the tumult of the skies, of which storms are the pinnacle. Raises the potency of storms. Words the fingers don't guide shit. Stop telling Passion me to follow them. Divine Beast Frost Stomp. Old affinity, usable on all melee. So I might as well go with that. There's so many freaking lore videos to watch after this. About how much do we have left to do in this? Uh, a decent amount. We're not even halfway done. Mm. I do like how you can just decide screw it and be a bird though. And technically, can't we also do stuff to uh, go screw this on a dragon? Uh, yes. In fact, uh, we should go do that. Well, technically, it'd work better for me, so let's see here. Oh, nope. I would need to uh, go talk to Renala, get this reset. Oh? Uh, because I switched from Faith to Arcane. Uh, that would do it. But it should only take a minute to go over there. While you two are having fun in here. 
That's me, always spending runes, having fun. Oh, so Alex, if you want to level up a uh, Quaglin or whatever, you can do that. Already maximum bit ago. Yeah, we're sort of yeah we're sort of way ahead of you, and you're going full naked build now. I see. Okay. <laughs> what? I'm wearing clothing. Yeah. The speedo. I was gonna call it what it is, but then I the loincloth that it is, but then I figured the speedo would be more fun. Plus, it's summer. You need to keep in the, we need to keep in the theme, right? Stomp, stomp. Hmm. And I've got a giant uh sunflower head. I grabbed the Ash of War for no good reason. Also, do you not actually see me? I see like... you. Let's check your stream. Oh, I see you. Wow, well, you don't. You're you don't actually properly see me. Oh, so you do have clothes on, they're just invisible? Uh, I use the Dragon Transformation. <laughs> huh. Oh. Yeah, you still look like a fleshy dude to us. I'll set up the table and see if it changes anything. Nope, you still look like a fleshy guy. Yeah, I don't see yep. your dragon form. Guess that's something Seamless Co-op has to work on. Well, uh, Until then, if we we'll want to get the other transformation, let's go to Jagged Peak Mountainside. Uh, 
Well, at least now we can just call it an Emperor's New Clothes situation. Jasper is convinced that only he can see his new form. Erm, um, but the reality is he's just naked the whole time. So you're calling him a uh, furry from the early days when it wasn't known by, like, everybody? It's definitely a dragon. I think it's at this point. What is the thing we're looking for that is up? It'll be another dragon heart. You seem addicted to eating those. I think we, you might have a problem. No, uh, he has a solution. You don't eat these. Oh? Uh, you just used the power of them to transform. Hmm. I think you know where the heart's at? I do not. Someone I'm just following the along heart. what I Sorry, thought sorry. was the correct way to go. I don't even actually see you on my radar at the moment. I can see where Alex I guess is. I'm invisible. Guess so. Am I heading the right way then? I'm following him. Oh, okay. You can see him. And you can probably see this chair now. It is a, a glowing chair. Yep. It's one of the painters. And oh, she doesn't drop anything. Oh, there it is. Alright, so what you're saying is that the when it says consume the dragon heart and to gain its power, it's being metaphorical? Yep, pretty much. Because it uh, recreates itself. Turns human frame into ancient dragon and boosts dragon communion incantations. Huh. Apparently, I'm and not the one you get from the priestess increases dragon cult incantations. Ooh. Shiny. I'm apparently not allowed to use it at the moment, though. Oh, you had to take your armor off. Uh, that's why you did the strip thing. Gotcha. Oh sure, when I do it for the three fingers, it's horrifying. When you do it, transform into a dragon, suddenly it's... Uh, storehouse, first floor. What side of the map is that on? It's in the keep. Actually, I think we want to go to the back section. Too late. You already said first floor and I'm mid warp. Well, when you get done, go to the back section. Because we don't want to go to Mesmer just yet. That's what, out here and off to the side or something? That's an elevator here. Yeah, I'll just do the goddamn warp again. Back section? Yep. Hmm. Yeah, I, was gonna, I was gonna ask if I was in the right place, but clearly I am. Uh, no, you're not. I'm not, oh crap. Not again. Spiral's putting in some work. Wait, I can hear you. Well, yeah, because yeah, you're down there below the us. Floor. Hi. Look up behind you. Oh, I see, yeah. Even's head go to the back room. Right, right. Right, right, go to the back rooms. <laughs> yeah, nothing bad ever happens in those. Parian thrusting shield. I'm 
Elemental. That one's a very good weapon and shield. Wow, this is a long ladder. Yep. In this case, I guess I should be glad they're doing all the work for me, but... <laughs> I like how he fell over in the spiral, just kind of dipped down to the floor. I'm like, we still got it! We still got it! Fire Serpent. Ugh. Fire Serpent? Neat. A Mesmer spell. So we don't hmm. go up the side of the castle. Over here. Womp. Oh, so we do have to go this way. It's a douche tree of hey. flower. Yeah, hey, you look dragony. Oh yeah, now I see you. Now you're no longer naked. More blessed bone shard. Get ready for fun. Hm. I thought I'd gone in far enough that I would have stepped on it. Oh, great, this area. Is this another upside down castle thing? No. Actually, that's a baz, of course. This is just have fun being sniped while you're on small platforms time. And me without any ranged weapons. Hmm. Shime. Lots of bat statues, I see. Yep. They're adorable. Will you boop? I would absolutely boop. I mean, hell, I'd go back to that one uh, nice little alleyway that we had that has the one on top and just be like, hi up there. Little something for solo play, though. Boy, smithing seven. Hmm. Well, I guess Actually, the price is still right. Wait, what would you say? Hey, he said they're actually vaguely useful, and I said, well, the price is right. Go here. Yep, I hate this place. There's a ladder down as well. Does that have anything? Uh, we will be going there eventually. Yes. Oh, okay, so that's like a correct way forward that we don't want to do yet. Oh, it sounds like we found the snipey jackass. Oh good, he got jasper all over. Doesn't look like he dropped me anything. How rude. Alright, so what you're gonna wanna do over here... ...is that when I go down, jump on top of this thing. Oh. Okay. Uh, there's an item up here. That would make sense. Where, though? Oh, Ryan. over there. Okay, I see. 
And then you'll want to write it back down. Hold on. Let me... eh. I'm really scared of the jump. I'll go for... Okay, I'm good. I'm good. All set? Yeah. Yep. Ooh yeah, this is so freaky. <laughs> Don't mention how much I hate this place. Ooh. Rune of an unsung hero? That sounds like it's a lot. Uh, and then you can come on back up. Okay. You got the rune, Alex? Yeah, I got it. Okay. There's basically just one item left we can grab. Up here. Oh. Way off over here. Easy, it's gonna be to fall and die. Oh, never mind, we can't get to it from this way. <sighs> ah. And I don't know what that item is. Hmm. Neither. And I don't think you can actually get back to it, so we gotta take these ladder, ladder down. Careful, you almost landed on me. Yep, sorry about that. That was ever so slightly terrifying on both of our accounts. Yeah, it could have easily shoved either of us out. I was half expecting it to when I saw how far out on the walkway you were going. Well, get ready, because it's going to be tight. I'll just get the other one as it comes up and goes back down. That might be the wiser course of action looking at it here because we can barely fit just two of us. It's yeah. almost like they designed assuming you'd be playing by yourself. Who thought? Who would have thought? What a strange idea. Playing a game like this on your own? Who'd want to do that? Crazy masochists. I mean, they've even got Seamless Co-op working for, uh, Elden, I mean, uh, Armored Core 6. Hmm. Nice. Does that game even have the semi, the regular semi, uh, multiplayer these games have? Nope. Because people just love giant robot teams. Can't blame them. Hmm. Okay, this is where the fun box is that we're absolutely not going to go to because, uh, through him. I mean, it's not I'm pretty the final sure boss we can of take Sekiro, him. is it? Never played it, couldn't tell you. That said, though, we can probably take him. Well, if you're sure. I'm sure I'm happy to give it a shot. Cover your runes. I don't have a ton. I have 400k. You should probably use those. I don't have enough to level. Oh. Uh, you might want to put on your good equipment then. Cookies? Hold up. You got, you got a couple of cookies you can use. Maybe. Ooh, Fire Knight Hild. I should seriously consider that one. This is a destroyed. bring your best one. This one's a under great sort of cast fire. Dear friend of of the sage. Enjoy. Yeah, this one's not experiment time. This one is uh, good luck. <laughs> I do actually think Queen is a pretty good one, if only because they're very aggressive. That can help out. Mm. They also aren't as fragile mm. as the uh, Tengu was. Hmm. Not enough.
Did you only have that one? No, I just thought it'd be enough on its own. Remember, I don't have access to the exact number or the open. Oh, it's like not a sale, sell place. Uh, it tells you the exact number. Yeah, if you look in status, it'll show you the numbers. Oh. Oh, they actually added Nothing numbers. that, but on the basic screen, it shows it to you. Really? All I see is how many I have, not how many I need. Alright, I spent an upgrade point. Cool. Alright, do not go out there. Uh, okay, step out and then summon. Oh dear, Alex did not follow directions. Probably had to uh, wait and check that he had uh, been ready for it. Yeah, I was making sure my equipment was in order. Commander Gaius. Huh, well, the good news is this. The bad news is this is a Sekro boss, but the good news is it's not what I thought it would be. Ugh. I'm not sure this is even actually reaching him. It is. For fuck's sake. Of course, the boss that wants to come run you over all the time would not decide to do so on me. <laughs> I'm just gonna use fucking nails here. Gravity, do you? I knew we targeted me. Radon, you are not. Quit pretending. Also, eat shit and die. Well, that wasn't too bad. See? I told you we could take him. He is definitely a lot worse alone. Oh god, yeah. And most of the fucking bosses are. Yeah, even if I couldn't attack very often, the fact I simply kept him off you guys while you were dealing your damage, that did a lot. Touch. Oh, and I forgot to use a uh, rune, like I was planning. Hmm. And now that we killed him, let's go kill his wife. After all, she's withholding his pants. What? Yep. We're going to go kill his wife because she's withholding his pants. She know. has his pants. We want all of the set, not part of the set. So, we're killing her and taking his pants. And pants can't. Don't worry, there's a lower reason for this. And it's going to make you question things more than if you hadn't read it. Eh, not really. Basically, he, he was an albinuric. As such, pants are useless for him. Right, the late stage albinurics lose their legs. That's why he's riding a giant boar. Bear pack, basically. They chose... So the girls chose the dire wolves and he chose the bio, bo, dire war. Also, uh, he was uh, basically a senior student with Radon. Hmm. Does make sense given the spells he was slinging. Ah... Uh. Our delicious reward. There's nothing in the plate. Also, fun fact, uh, him, Mesmer, and Radon were all best friends. Oh. Well, that's gonna suck. 
In fact, when you look at some of the lore, like, uh... Uh, it's kind of crazy. I would imagine. Like, Ansbach apparently knew Radon when he was just a kid. Hmm. Yeah, he does say he was a pretty old fucker, so that does make some sense. Alright, well, back to Shadow Keep back gate. So what are the big ones we still have left? Uh, Mesmer, Matter, Rakasha, or Rakshasa, whatever his name is. Hmm. Raksha? Somehow don't have that one. Hmm. Uh, you should. Oh, and we should. still have the Pugilant -like Knight left as well. Hmm. And a Starfall Beast. Yep, but that's why we went this way. Mm hmm. Also, technically, to, uh. Oh, Shadow Blessings. Oh, yeah. He was worth taking down. And yeah, two, two Sentinel whole, Knights. Yeah, two or three whole, Sentinels, I mean. Yeah, hmm. two whole blessings. That's a huge bonus. Oh, yeah. Absolutely worth it. He might possibly be one of the, mo the most rewarding boss so far. I mean, honestly, I think he was the most rewarding boss so far. Also, we're going to have a big old giant bear over here, I think. Hmm. No clue. Don't think I went this way. There's more of those sunflowers, though. Yeah, that's a giant sunflower. Sunflower of pain! Huh, I guess there isn't a big bear. Hmm. Disappointed you didn't get a dragon heart from it. They don't drop those. They were going to at one point. Yeah, they're not far along, and if they're <laughs> far along enough in their transformation for that yet. Oh, some gold fireflies. That's something. I guess there's nothing here. Oh well. It was just those sunflowers. You're saying that so that we won't be expecting a boss fight when we try to leave, huh? What? When would he ever pull a stunt like that? There is going to be one, isn't there? Yeah, Slade's been through here, he might know. I know some of the ones on the other route, but I never went up here, so if there was a secret ambush boss, I wouldn't have known. I've been out this way, though. Yeah, there is this where the secret ambush boss is. I mean... I don't think they're really much of a secret, or an ambush.
screwed. Or don't do the fucking dash then? Cool. Thanks, Torrent. You are forever the helpfulest thing. Ugh. I would want to revive him this time. He needs to spend some time dead to think about his sins. Enemy fell. Now for the second one. If we want to take it on, yeah. May as well. It's not like they were hard. Still got two thirds of my mana bar. So, bitch. Fool, I was but the diversion. <laughs> Ow. God damn it, Torrent. Could you please, please try to do something useful? Of course. Eh. It's chasing you. The all the voice break does to interrupt his current animation. Bonk, 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 bonk. Nope. Not today. <sighs> and now we can go visit America's home. We'll take a Spoilers. Sunday. We'll take a complete the Sunday home, but the other one is on the other side of the continent. Uh, no, this is literally where she was uh, raised. This is her actual home. I was, I was making a show. Uh, remember how it's the shamans that were getting put into jars? That were her, that was her people, the Newman. There is a very heavy implication that uh, she was the last one left here. That basically the rest of them had already been murdered. And uh, she decided that, uh, you know what? Nah. Alright, then nobody got the shitty reference. Stand for mind. Also, uh, over here. Probably got it wrong anyway. In case you ever wondered why one of her braids is shorter than the other. around here. Huh. Who's the one in the tree? It's a Statue of America. Oh, I thought it was a person that was sealed in there. Boost holy damage at most. A braid of golden hair cut loose. Queen America's offering to the... Damage, negation, so, uh, I'm gonna be right back in just a minute. No one left to add. Were you two taking the ambiance? She never returned home again. We'll be all the way over there again?
there anything up here? Over here, no, so it look like it. Up. There's something down, though. You just need to be very, very, very slow and careful. Which torrent is not. Yeah, don't use torrent for it. It's a lot of uh, just drop. And then the last part, just walk off. Welcome back. You know that's useless right now, right? Eh. I don't even know what it is. Anyway, I guess I will go get a uh, place for you two to teleport back to. Sure. Uh, but yeah, you'll want to go there later, but not right now. Mm, I can still get the belly bearing right now, though. Actually, I think you can warp back to the hinterland. Hmm. Damn puppet. It's a puppet of Anna. A puppet of Anna? That's what you wanted me to see? Hmm? A what now? A puppet of Anna? Uh, there is a, uh, bell bearing thing that's underneath of that in one of the lower levels. I already snagged it though, so you don't have to worry about it. We got fallen star beast to stab. Mm hmm. And stab repeatedly. I didn't receive it, so I guess I should grab it anyway. I mean, when yeah, I we're gonna have to the, go uh, back there anyway, so. When uh, I hand it into the hags, it should unlock it for everybody anyway. Alrighty. Is there anything below, beneath the chest that was opened? Yep. Because we've been there before. Alright. Alright, where do I go again? Enterlands. I think at a moment we might be getting a closer, guys. Yep. Oh, it's too late now. I'm already loading. Hmm. And we're definitely going to want to sit at this one. Oh, yeah. Oh boy, now we get to do another Shadow Tree Avatar. No. They're not going to be spammed like the Air Tree ones? No. They're that one just shows up. Yeah. <laughs> it's the Avatar for that one tree. There isn't a million of them like the Air Tree. Thing is the earth tree freaked the fuck out and spewed seeds everywhere. I mean, it's a plant. Why wouldn't it spread seeds? Ah, uh, because everybody believed it wouldn't, but as soon as it was set on fire, it freaked out and sent seeds everywhere. Because it was like, oh shit, I'm about to be burned down. Kids, kids, kids! Dragonflies. How we hate thee. Let us count the corpses. Now 
Now does it look familiar? Fallen Star. Memories of Fallen Star. I swatted. <laughs> that half HP? That's odd. Well, that was easy. So much for that. Is it supposed to start at half HP? Not that I know of. But, it was uh, full HP for me. Man, for us it was just a half. Uh, but it did not give me any runes. Really? I got runes. Hmm, me too. How many did you get? I didn't check the exact number, but... Yeah, I wasn't looking down there at the time. Yeah, I saw the counter go up, I just didn't see the exact number. I got the item at least. Which I'm gonna have to try out. See if it's any good. Will it suit my purposes? And crush my enemies. Because if we can't do that, it's not very good gravity magic. Hmm. For pulling in enemies. Interesting. And here we're going to start running into the really annoying... Uh enemies because there were no annoying enemies before uh, remember when we just randomly got put off torrent and dropped on the ground and stunned for like 10 seconds yeah there's like every single one of those will do that to you huh annoying Blame him for that one. That one, he was definitely tanking for me. I switched to the regular fire one. Alright, see you later, Emma. Thanks for stopping mm -hmm. by. So, is there much of anything there? Yeah, just those three things. Yeah. Blame. Yeah, I switched to my regular fire. A bottle, fire perfume bottle for this. I think it might be a bit mm. better since these things are weak to flame. Mm -hmm. Plus, it doesn't split its damage between all the elements. It doesn't do that anyway, it just does fire damage. I know, that's why I said I was using it over the Frenzy Flame when the Frenzy Flame one splits its damage across... No, it just does fire damage. No, the Fire Spark Perfume Bottle is Dex B, while Frenzy Flame Perfume Bottle they, is... C. You realize you were saying they were doing fire, right? That the fire one did fire damage? Yeah, both of them do fire damage, but this one scales better. The fire one scales better since I have maxed uh, Dex. How? Focus wasn't the elemental damage because they both deal fire. The, my focus was that one 
will de deal better damage simply because I have virtual fact I have max. Oh, what the hell? You are surrounded by everything in here. It's fucked up. Oh, I'm being attacked from behind. Like ten of them spawned on top of me. Hmm. Holy crap! That one's from twelve million miles away. Yup. Different one heading for you, Alex. He uses me as a human shield. Wow. Incoming. Uh, got another one. They're gonna be fucking everywhere. I'm gonna be real with you, Jasper. I'm surprised you're still alive. Hopefully that uh, gravitational spell helped out. Yeah, I ate it so that he wouldn't, because he probably would have been killed. Uh, well, one of them had grabbed me, which meant I was immune to the rest of them. Oh, well, that's good. Then. Does that mean it numbs your head? Oh, the fact that ten of them spawned on me is what's uh, what's really weird. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't realize so many had gone on, gone after. Why so many were after you? I didn't know they were that clumped together. I think it might have just spawned every single one of them. Kind of seems like, given that we're not seeing any now. Good, it means we can travel through here or without being in trouble. That will still be getting stunned, left, right, and center. Somewhere around here, there's like a hole you can fall into. So maybe we should get this uh, this thing in here first. Yeah. Gotta use the giant finger bong. Be good for you guys. Yeah, but mostly been using the uh, blessed blue dew one. I've mostly been using the blessed red dew. Hmm. Sparkle. Unfortunately, I'm not sure where that hole in the ground is at. I don't remember if the uh, other group I was playing with had actually gone for anything like that. I think we might have just hit up the, hanger bo the finger bong and just sucked off back to uh, Meteor. Meteor. Emir, Madere, Dogier, if I can remember. I can always look it up later. Or, well, mm -hmm. not later, but, you know. Eventually! What do you know? They're gold inside, just like the dragons. What, the giant fingers? Mm-hmm. see the uh, back of it where it was open and it's got a bunch of the like gold flecked flesh like the uh, ancient dragons do.
Oh, Alex awoke the nest. Yep. Well, this is a nice color. Yeah. I was like, is it just me or is it getting strangely murkily green? <laughs> Probably from a boss we have to kill. Probably. I am not seeing anything yet. To be fair, it is kind of hard to see fucking anything in here right now. At least we're not being poisoned. Yeah, yet. We are being chased, though. Hmm. So this seems like a big whole lot of nothing. Mm-hmm. A suspicious amount of nothing. They do seem to be staring kind of out in both directions, though. Hmm. Alright, give me a minute. I'm gonna look at where we need to go. Hi. Okay, we need to go to, uh, hmm. To hmm? To hmm, then. Where's hmm? I'll try to see that one on my map. Finger runs of Deho. Oh, we need to go to the Flagstone Hill of Grace. For the what one? Oh, yeah. Fingerstone Hill of Grace. Stone Hill. I just realized this peninsula and, uh, looks like a fingerprint. Yep. Lack of subtlety, that's for sure. And uh, have fire ready. You say that like I'm not always fire. Where is that one? It's the closest one to where you are right now. Just go north. Oh, it's okay. to the west of where you're at. Ah, yes. My other north. No south. Like how I keep going west when I'm supposed to go east. Hmm. I don't know how I keep mixing up east and west. Not exactly directions people use a whole heck of a lot most of the time. Unless you're not familiar with traffic somewhere you're going. That we're going to be getting attacked by a colossal sized finger creeper. Per usual. Which is probably what all of this uh, gunk and stuff was. That would make sense. This one looks a little strange. Probably expecting to take fall damage from that. There's also more casters looking at us. Alright, so somewhere over here is going to be a hole. Hmm. 
Are you always on the search for those holes? He is when he smells treasure. here. Yeah, there's too many finger traps here. I can't be killing all those guys. Well, I guess if we're looking for the source of all this uh, goop, wouldn't it probably be somewhere in the middle of all of this? Uh, it looks like it's right up over here. Hmm. Oh. Behind me. That's a pretty hole. Where is it? For some reason. Huh, this is weird. Do we have, is it like the Radigan situation where we have to do something to uh, make a hole here? No. Also, I think you mean we're on. Right, the only right. hole that Radigan tries to make is in our skull. Right. just comes down here. Damn. So sure I had it. <sighs> oh, here it is. Found it? Yep. I don't fall into it. Unless you want to die early. Also, your little uh, magical gather everything up so it might be good over here. Oh, sure. Fisher things, huh? Yep. And there will be really? a colossal finger creeper in here. Lovely. That sounds awful. Oh my fucking god, why are you eyeballing me? Eyeball a freak. Fuck you. And now we can have the child. Finger creeper ashes. Blech. No, thank you. Apparently, he is a better support, uh, summon than, uh, the Finger Maiden one. Ah, uh, because oh, of the wow. paralysis, right? But anyway, back to the Cathedral. Of Shadows? Now the Cathedral, not the, uh, Shadow Fortress.
Shadow Tower? Shadow Temple? Uh, the Cathedral Shadow Shadows something? is from Shin Megami Tensei. It's where you fuse demons. Uh, Yeah, I didn't play that one. Uh, Vengeance, the 5 just got a re-release in Vengeance, and it's pretty good if you're interested in starting. Mm. If I need to, I have a local friend very nearby who's very, very, very into that series. Now we can get some more lore. Oh yeah. Coming up for that delicious lore. So the other group just skipped by frickin' everything, so I didn't get to hear much of any of it. This evening is a sign. Do you recall what I said that Marika and the fingers that guided her were unsound from the start? Well, the truth lies deeper still. It is their mother who is damaged and unhinged. The fingers are but unripe children, victims in their own right. We all need a mother, do we not? A new mother. A true and you get one last or three from him. To give birth to further malady. Hmm. Fleeting microcosm. Fleeting microcosm. Conjures that plunge it pulses a single wave cool. speed the worst. <clears throat> Conjures the foe speed the pulses. Charging against the potency. Secret hollowed rites. The broken discard are fully willing to cling to fleeting simulacra, earning them some mediocre of sympathy. May you join the Hmm, something tells me the lore in there is a pretty big deal. The one that says uh is uh, the incomplete will cling to that which they can. No. And you're gonna wanna Actually, we'll probably just want to sit down over here. It says now, just be on your way. Now, oh, let's Lex, see if I can get that new stream. spell on here. And yeah, those would be all over mm -hmm. if we were connected to the main mm -hmm. server. Mm -hmm. This is seamless co-op, so uh, it doesn't connect to that. Sorry, Roxling. You've been a wonderful staple this entire time, but new spell. Thankfully, we're going to have the perfect place to test it. I'm guessing you've already fought this boss. Yeah, we did this uh, yesterday. It's weird that it only lets you do this stuff. Hmm. Beep. I like how you can just slide down a uh, wooden and rope ladder. Yep. It's gonna hurt like hell, that's for sure. You can't, it's just... Eh. That's what you got gauntlets for. Yes, I do have. I oh, cool. It summons it under them. Yeah. War has a huge startup delay, but it's definitely good if I can land it. Oh, rat, I should have used the other ones, and she's actually tarnished. She actually could get madness. Mm -hmm. uh, is the next boss also tarnished? Uh, no. It's about as far from tarnished as it can possibly go. More or less. I don't see either of you anymore. We went on the left-hand side to pick up a cookbook. You would think they would have a, uh, a little breaks out here. Hmm. Also, if you, uh... Eh. Wait, what's the finger? Like the finger... 
If you like the finger mimics, there's one over here too. All right, everybody gather close. And sorry, you were what now, Alex? You said there's an item over here? Yeah, it's uh, just up on the rock up there. And then you can jump up here from there. The slope isn't too bad. I hold up and yes, I have to gather up close. This shit's about to get weird. Fingerprint Nostrum. Not sure if Alice is close enough. Looks like I am. Oh no, we have to do it individually. Shouldn't have to. Took all of us the last time. Weird. Well, Alright, we'll all we'll take turns taking a bit from the giant bong. Apparently so. Well, be sure to summon once you get in here. Are these the bottoms of the fingers that are up there? Seems like. Here we are. Met here, mother yeah, of fingers. Yeah, say hello to mommy, dearest. Are bullshit. How big she is, this should do some good damage. Yeah, it is. She's like, mine's art. bigger. Yeah, so she's the artificial mother that he, he created? No, this is the literal mother of all fingers. You know the uh, two fingers doing the whole, hey, we want to talk to the uh, greater will thing? They're calling her. He's supposed to talk to the greater will. They aren't talking to the greater will, they're talking to her. And he was the one that took the cup to the greater will. Oh. But like it's explained, uh, she hasn't been listening to the greater will for a long time. Or rather, she hasn't heard from him in a long time. Mm -hmm. You'll notice she also didn't really quite die exactly. More kind of like teleport warped out. Like a big gravity looking thing. It looked like she pulled an Astel and fucked off. And you're gonna wanna go back to the cathedral. We got a whole lot more murdering to do. Mm hmm. Night's on. Will we be facing a tarnish this time? Uh, close enough to, I think. I don't know what he counts as. Hmm. I'll bring the other one. Hope that works. But this is where the impreg that I mentioned came from. Were you looking forward to it this entire time? Eh. I like how my summon just kind of boking her. A fine mother. You will be. Alright, 
not a player model, so sadly he doesn't get that madness, but he still does. Any good? Once again, no ruins. Hmm. Weird. Did you at least get his outfit and all that? Yeah. Not that I can use it. I think it's probably gonna be good for Slade if it even works. I think the hat might be good for you. Although you might want to take all the fingers off the rope if you're going to wear that. Do they move like it was on him? I don't know. But as I said, you might want to wear the hat. Why is that? Uh, because it boosts your intelligence and, arc and arcana for using your perfumer bottle. Interesting. I will say uh -huh. I'm quite satisfied with the Queenie summon. Queenie summon because you saw how useful they are being, even though they're just poking at stuff from a distance. Poke, poke, poke. All right, we can use the uh, Iris of Grace on here if you want to. Use what? The Iris of Grace, which I think only Slade can use for some reason. Hmm. And no you get her the Spirit summon. However, you do not want to use her as a spirit summon, or even a blade raid her. Yep. I see them not. Why would you not? Uh, because that breaks her. So you want the iris up, Grace? Guess that answers that. And now we can go back up to the hinterlands. Alright, so you said I shouldn't use her as a summon? No, do not upgrade her either. Not until you get the second half of her. Ah. Uh. She gets an upgrade. I'll continue using Queenie, or maybe use the fire guy, Hilder. Don't worry. There's nothing to fight in between uh, this and upgrading her. You can use whatever you like. As long as you use your torrent. I went to the Hitlerlands like you said. Mm -hmm. I don't see either of you here. Technically, you already know where to go. Hmm. I do? I picked the wrong hill. I think I did pick the wrong hill. Yeah, oh, we're heading up to uh, her village again. And then jumping off the backside. So exactly what I did before. Pretty much. Yep. Oh, so that's the doll version. Also, this place is really pretty at night. Mm-hmm. Once again, I don't see either of you. Uh... Well, once we get off torrent, you will. I can see you. Can you see me now? Nope, you don't Hi. even show up on my mini-map. Wow. Weird. I'm like right in front of you. And you've gone by me. I'm chasing you! Now I just need to remember where I'm supposed to jump off. Hmm. You're headed the right way so far. Just 
Shut the stop. Well, you found the first part easy enough. You might want to get off torrent if you're going to do that, though. That was a little reckless. The first one's not too bad. It's these later ones that started to get tricky. Hmm. That they do. Usher Anne into the store of Nyan Yolan's spirit ashes. Yep, 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 yep. And now we can go back to, uh, the round table. Slade will want to look at his brand new possible spell. Which one of them? Uh, this big old rock summoning explosion thingy. Spirits of the two sword hands of night, while they're being possessed no, by the earth's dollars. Ah, staff of the great beyond. That can allow you to cast both sorceries and incantations. Two sword hands of night, thus were they cultivated to become those terrifying masters of blades, though the burden of the deed hearts frail. Ashen tail fingers of Mater, mother of fingers, microcosm raised aloft over the crux they form. Catalysts for casting both sorceries and incantations. Receive signs from the greater will from beyond the, from the beyond of the microcosm. Despite being broken and abandoned, she kept waiting for another message to come. Also, the weapon already comes with a custom uh, Ash of War on it. Really? Yep, it is the only Remorous weapon that can be, uh, modified. Hmm. Cool. I also picked up the, uh, rock explosion thing from the, uh, boar guy. I don't think I'm going to be using that weapon, though. Hmm. Yeah, the Twin Moons weren't really working out too well for me anyway, so let's try out this new stuff. Also, I am going to go and, uh... Oh damn, Blades of Stone is a two-slot one. I'm going to go and duplicate one of these remembrances, so I'll be right back. Mm-hmm. Have fun, don't die. Staff of the Great Beyond. Staff Ashen with a tail finger. There's a meteor. Microcosm raised aloft the crooks they've had less for casting bolts with reason incantations. Mother received signs of the greater will to beyond. Mm -hmm. Despite being broken and abandoned, she kept waiting for another message to come. No skill. Gazing finger. The head of Matir, Finger Mother, wields Ah, there's just not enough memory stones in this game. And within the center of the fingerprint that wrinkles the creature's foremost protrusion, the tiny. Well, you could always put on the talisman that gives you more. Hmm. Might have to at this rate. Remembrance the wild boar rider. Sword lance, weapon once wielded by Commander Gaius. Weighty and capable of being brought to bear with the great force. His arm shows true potential when used. Oh, oh well, this is annoying. He himself was mm -hmm. boar. Blades it won't sword. actually let me use the thing. Gravity manipulating sorcery. Weird. Blade -like so I think I'm going to have to kick you two out. Guys, we're done. We're good rivals in our youth, and this sorcery is a product. Now go forth. Man, I'll go have a sip of my drink while I'm doing this. And you know what? While we're doing this, we can do the horn scent fight. While we're separate. Yeah. Should we be helping them or going against them? Uh, I'm going against them because three helm. Hmm. Alrighty. Well, um, where which grace do I go for for that again? Shadow keep. 
All right, and it would not let me use that, so I want to try a different one. Hmm. Main gate plaza. Unless one of you two decided to use it. To use what? I think he's trying out one of the uh, headless coffin statue things to uh, get a remembrance duplicated. Ah. I just used the one on top of the hill. Oh, well, that explains why I can't use it. You need to use those in your own freaking game. I didn't know it would cut me off like that. Cut you off, I mean. Yeah, don't the ones back in uh, the main game let each of you do it? No. Oh. Could have sworn I have before. It might have been in the old version, but I don't think it does in the new version. Ah. Uh. Seriously, which, how could I not find this one? It's straightforward, right? Grace was it out again? Hmm. I'll just go to all of them. One of them's going to be correct. Just going to take a while. Okay, and Hornsen sucked and died. Which grace was it again? I went to the... Main Gate Plaza. I went there, but it wasn't... Whatever. Uh, there's like a side door that goes out to the big staircase. And at the top of the staircase, it, the fight stones should be just over on the right after you get to the top of them. Also, it has me stuck inside the, uh, place. Hmm. Fun. So let's try that again, I guess. Short, 
Uh, did it work for you, Slade? Uh, I'm still talking to Gideon here. Apologies. You want me to go hit the fight? Oh. Yeah, that's what I mentioned we do. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm still upgrading the staff. Kindly Mikula never betrays a vow. Go. Well, I basically got everything from that guy. Oh, I don't have any somber ancients left. Oh well. Well, I beat him, but I'm not going back. <sighs> yeah, I seem to be stuck in the invasion mode. So I'm stuck in beige mode. How do I get out? You can just teleport. I imagine once I get out, it'll immediately give me the hmm. items. But if not, I can just do the fight again. Yep, looks like it's broken. Which is? The fight. Let's see if it's still here. If not, then yeah, it's definitely broken. Because I didn't get any rewards or anything. Oh, no, they're still here. Yep, like I said, it's broken. Hmm. Okay, I'll go up and see what I can do. That is the NK Plaza. Loady, 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 load, load, load. <laughs> Let's see if I can even survive getting past the guys. <laughs> I just ran. Hmm. Fair point. I knew this day would come. The nature of your kind. I will with all the joy. Catch me on the gingerbread man. Interfere not with my will. What a pride. Now go and make yourself useful. Apologies. Oh, mother, wife. Kindly Mikula never betrays a vow. Well, give me just a minute and I'll open up the world. It's open. And I'll be right back in just a minute. He did his line, and now I'm just kind of sitting here. Very long death speech, that's for sure. Yeah. Hi, Letta. Are we? Are are, are we done here, Letta? We're done. We're done. Everything good. Let's just teleport back to the main plaza thing and. Uh, Go back and see what's going on. The good news is when I went back, it was still there, so we didn't lose the rewards. The bad news is I did it again a couple times and it still bugged out. Hmm. So it's just plain not working at all for now, then? Unfortunately. Hmm. I'm back. Welcome back. You can join whenever you're ready. One of the vulgar <clears throat> militia got in here, but don't worry, I took care of it before it got to you.
Oh, let me use that there. Huh. Okay. Guess I warp and then I join. Yeah, you can't join if you're in invasion mode. Hmm. Doop, doop. Scribble, scribble. Joiny, join. Be careful when throwing that fire around. You don't want to hit a uh, on back. You want to hit what? On back. The old fucker that's He's doing investigations. Here. Oh, he is. Huh. Mm -hmm. I was only attacking the shadow dude and the uh, vulgar militia. But yeah, I have a lot of AOE, so I must be wary. Right, we need to get back into that library. I know there's supposed to be some way to open this thing, but I don't know how we do it. Uh, it's from inside that library. Uh, that to do it then. We don't need to go up and around this way then? Uh, we will eventually. Okay. And Alex decided to just block the entire way. Block no, nothing. Can't you, could, you couldn't <laughs> fit in there for what you can't fit in there right now. <laughs> As we both casually jump through. <laughs> he was struggling before I got in there. <laughs> Don't worry, I'm sure there's just something something your giant butt. And that was all that was in here. His giant butt. Whatever it was I picked up. Ah, uh, the talisman. Yeah. I think that one's the lightning one? It was, yeah. Now that we have, you know, so many enemies left that use lightning on us. Anyway, Spock is in here. Righteous tarnished. After unburdening my soul to you, I had hoped to make a fresh start. But there was one thought I could not dislodge from my mind. So, here I am. Quite unable to move on. After Lord Moke's slaying at his dynastic palace, it appears his body has been absconded with and taken straight to kind Mikola. Surely you recall that I once served Lord Moke. So they stole Moke's body. After failing him in every regard mm -hmm. and losing so And it's up to us to figure out why. I'd do anything to make amends in whatever meager way well, I can. Well, we know Mikola lost his body. What could they possibly The implications are rather... What could the he didn't lose it, he gave it up. What could they possibly have in mind for Lord Moog's remains? The implications are... He doesn't have to inherit the body itself, he could modify it to a new one, so long as the res end result is equal or smaller in size. I think it's called reconstitute. I mean, Moog is a lot bigger than Mikla. Oh, then it's a lot easier to just reconstitute the body into something usable for him. There sure are a lot of kukri in here. I think we got everything this way, we can gotta go upstairs. Yep, upstairs we go. Mm, that one's already dead. 
upstairs is... Where ah, do we go to here. Go upstairs? Right over here. Oh, there it is. Thanks. Mm -hmm. I only just found out myself. I <laughs> uh, went through a little bit of this this morning, I guess, last night. But uh, this place I didn't remember terribly well. I was closer to the end of our uh, playtime, so... Everyone was getting sleepy and grouchy. Sneak up behind and stealth madness. Don't you just hate when that happens? Yeah. Madness always creeping up on you. Uh, I know how to okay, stay thematically appropriate. There. Hmm, I already killed everything. Yeah, I didn't have the smithing stone from back here, though. Oh boy, three fives. My smithing stone cup runneth over. Yeah, hmm. They dropped me a smithing stone eight. Yeah, they have rather expensive smith smithing stones that they can drop. Hmm. Sadly, they probably don't have uh, somber ancients. The beast horns. I think we yes, had to kill dragons for the ancients. Mm. I think we already killed all three. There's one zombie that's still alive. Alright, Alex, get over here. Don't worry, those things are weak enough that even I can backstab them and one-shot them. Well, I hope you like feet. Why would you ask a question like that? He didn't have to get up close and personal with the, some of them. <laughs> oh, I was wondering how we get that item. Isn't there one in the hair beneath the head? Yep. It'll be. We'll get it eventually. That. Oh my god, that nearly fucking killed me. Well, you got your revenge for earlier. This is also about just uh, spirits will also pursue me close trail. Seeing the people, people flood the holy core that leads the air to barring scar, shadow tree barring access. However, there's no route that leads there from the storehouse. Perhaps mm -hmm. there's another way from somewhere else in this keep.
That's the proper way that time. So we want to go this way. Oh, I don't want to fall on the edge. Remember. Nope. And they've got a whole lot of edges for you. The Lord of them. Him distracted for you. Smithing stone eight. I, I said down. often I meant it. <clears throat> nope, here <clears throat> come the bats. Oh boy. Gotta love bats. Down here first. Secret right, the divine gateway. If you can decipher it, which scrub secret right, divine gateway found, found a lord will shouldn't there. God's return. Now back up we go. Require a vessel. I think we found out what they need with the body. Mm hmm. Going by this ritual we found. Oh. I don't think I've actually looked at the item. Yeah, secret right scroll. You can decipher the scroll, which describes a secret rite in which a divine gateway can be found in the tower and shrouded by shadow. A lord will usher in a god's return, and the lord's soul will require a vessel. Huh. Don't run forward, Alex. They're hanging by a thread. All that just for some red caps. Well, to be fair, it was just bats. Fire quail. Stuff. That's my fault. I hit him with my flames and he moved. Uh oh. Yoink! That one I got. <laughs> uh, I think we should go over this way first. We lead on. Open if I mesmer tonight? No. doesn't even have to be a backstab. Oh boy. Two sixes. <sighs> I'm getting a little tired myself. I don't think that was a tired boy. Boy, he's had a couple already and I have had a few myself. You're both correct.
Jumbo. By my lord. Will I ever make sense of that? By my lord. Will I ever make I don't think she was ever gonna make sense of this jumble. Mm. But she does seem to be calling on some kind of lord. Perhaps she Probably doesn't know. <laughs> yeah. Perhaps she doesn't know that we murdered the shit out of her lord already. No, she knows. She was there. She was. I don't remember seeing her as an NPC there. She even Where mentioned uh, Jaren. Yeah, Part of the reason why I... she was following Mikla is because Mikla cured her Scarlet Rot from the battle. Oh. I thought he wasn't having any luck doing cures. Just preventions. Halting briefly by sticking a pin in it. Well, you have to remember that uh, she wouldn't have had the uh, super ultra rot that uh, Melania has. That's true. Now, rise. <laughs> Rise. Also, screw that furniture. In Did we hit everything back here? No, we still gotta go up the level. Hmm. Yeah, that's where we uh, talk to her, isn't it? Yep. There's also a grace. Good. Good. So I don't think we want to rest at it just yet. Oh. Ever make sense of this jumble? By my oh, I'm afraid I'm busy. Oh, curse upon my lack of foresight. I should have asked Ansbach to impart his knowledge when I had the chance. I'm afraid I'm truly. Oh, we want to teleport down to the storehouse. First floor. First prize. First floor. Also, when we talk to Ansbach, do not give him the secret right thing yet. Okay. Have something else we have to do first? If you give him the secret right thing, you can't do Freya's quest. Oh. Really? group I was playing with uh, yesterday, I'm pretty sure they didn't do this scroll thing right away, and he just gave a letter to give to her. I guess it's a different thing. Eh, maybe you can just do it either way and seamless. Shrug. Also, I don't remember at all how you get to him. Uh, I don't think it's through that way. Doesn't seem like no. Well, we yeah, lost Alex. Back and around through here. No, I'm bugged. Oh. Why did I die from that? Oh, because no you idea. were floating in the air for too long. I guess killing so is a it... failsafe to be sure I can't be stuck. Yep, pretty much. Basically decided you were floating for long enough that you hit terminal velocity. Anyway, Just here's the rock. Mm. Alright, well, maybe we can give the paper to him. I just know we have to mention Freya. Mm hmm. So, do we hand it over now, or are we doing it after? Uh, yeah, I went ahead and did it. The absolute, okay. The absolute, 
Looks like he already counts as having been given it. Uh, but we'll have to teleport back to the, uh, well, we'll need to go sit at the storefront front. Or storehouse front, or store, whatever. Talk to him again. Apparently, I have a hard time hitting them with this thing because it keeps swinging it over their heads. <laughs> Target them, you'll aim down to hit them. I was targeting them. No idea then. Righteous Tani, could you please? Thanks to you, Freya possesses a youth I no longer have. This knowledge will surely yes. Perhaps I shouldn't, but this is the only. And now we can go up to the uh Seventh floor. Boink. I'm afraid I'm busy truly. From Suran's back on Earth. Oh, yes. As the festival of war concluded, General Radan's soul met an honorable end. But kindly Mikola wishes to revive it, which is fine by me. I know it would pain old Gerald, but war has always suited General Radan, and certainly far more than any honorable death. Endless war to invigorate the soul. So now we know that uh, Mikola also stole Radan's soul. All that remains oh. is the fight. I'm sure it won't be fine. Still look hilarious because a lot of mechanics that pretty much require you to use the uh, roll to avoid. Apparently the best way to avoid a nuclear blast is just do a little roly-poly at the time of impact. Or hold up your knife at just the right moment. Alright, we gotta get area. back over there. Pink. There's an item hiding back here. What are you? Oh, Revered Spirit Ash. Get back, Revered Spirit Ash. It was hiding on this thing. Well, we need to go down here anyway. Oh, oh that works. <laughs> To go down this new path, right? Yep, yep. This nice new, definitely not precarious path. And if I remember, was there anything around this one? Apparently not. Well, it was worth a look. Mostly. Mistake America is a bad sign. Yeah. Seeing much of anything America is usually a bad sign. <laughs> <laughs> I 
No healing. That's because we got a mini boss up here. Hmm. Your command may will handle him, Miss Slade. Yeah, as soon as I can actually get myself over there. Oh, he's ominously walking towards us. Because you ran up and aggroed him. I hate this place. I hate this place so fucking much. <laughs> so for once we can growl at him about running forward and aggroing the boss, huh? Doesn't look like he needed my help at all. All right, there's going to be a door up here. Do not go through it. And down we go. Because that leads to Mesmer. Hmm. And we don't want to do that yet. Don't want to fight him tonight. Absolutely not. Not ready huh. still. I mean, we could beat him, but uh, we still have the Ansbach and the uh, Horn Scent fights. Provided the Horn Scent one actually works at some point. Anyway, I think we'll finally want to go back down to the first floor in order to get the uh, item from that guy's hair. I'm starting to get exhausted. Assuming we're still doing it tomorrow. Well, it might not be a bad idea to start uh, figuring a place to wind down. Figuring out what we have left to go through, too. <laughs> Funny, Mesbert was uh, marketed as the main villain of the DLC, and yet you could beat him first bo as the first boss if you wanted. Uh, no, not technically. You still have to beat the hippo. Because it's a remembrance boss. Discovery boss. Where are these freaking stairs? Up? Oh, there they are. <laughs> They're in front of you the whole time. So we got one more level to go, though. Hmm. So like these stairs, stairs right are... There, but... Alright, looks like it's one more level up. Another smithing stone eight. They really pay out. Uh, please don't be crashing. Okay, good. It looks like it was just lag spike. I think slash hope. Show fuck or fuck. Oh, this spell takes forever to get off. I can't here it is. Final Pearl Drake. Ooh. 
Oh, there's an item over there too. Oops. Oh dear. Oh, I didn't die. Wonderful. Well, that's good at least. And... I don't mean I'm in the middle of a fight, but... It's a dueling shield. So you're an Urtree avatar now? Apparently. Hmm. Although the spell takes a whole lot of a wind-up. I mean, they have to do that whole giant jump into the air explosion thing first. Now that's a completely different spell. Hmm. Okay, so what now? Well, since you two are wanting to quit for tonight, uh, we can return to the bad NPC. We can return to the round table. Yeah, I hate to cut it off here, but I really am getting really exhausted. I mean, it is just about 5 a.m., so this is around the time we'd normally be stopping. Or thereabouts, too. I'm all set when you guys are. Alrighty. Well, hopefully everybody still watching and enjoyed. We'll see everybody again tomorrow. Same tarnished time, same tarnished channels. Maybe one of these two will get naked and dragony with me. Goodness. I don't see it. Alright, see you all next time. I mean, this one is red, Alex. <laughs> With white hair. <laughs>